Well, Miss Maglin. Well, Miss Maglin. Dorothy Spornak, you've stuck your nose in for the last time. <laughs> 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 this is the best video on YouTube. Anyways, I should start a uh, dang and rompa. Oh my goodness. Wait, 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 wait. Hell yeah! Chiaki, Sonia. Akane, Awari. See, I have to learn Kyoko, Gundam Tanaka, Kazuchi Soda, Mahiro Koizumi, Teratero Hanamura. Dude, I have to learn all these characters. Oh my god, this is loud. Nagito, ne Nekomaru, Ibuki Miyoto. It's too fast. Biakio. Yeah, that's Biakio, alright. I'll be right back. From the beginning Audio English, yes. Kind. Dude, there's no mouse. Hey. Hey. Can you hear me? Yes. Are you okay? You seem pretty out of it. To be honest, I'm also... No, everyone else feels the same too. Since we suddenly got put in this weird situation. Hey, are you listening? Yes. I don't understand. Why am I here? What happened? I should try to remember that first. Began to think, disentangling the twisted knots that had formed in my mind. Think, 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 think. As I gathered the fragments of my scattered memories, I began to piece together what actually happened. That's right, I... I... Danganronpa 2, Goodbye Despair. Game start.
Is this game a simulation? That day, it wasn't just a typical day for me. It was the day that felt truly significant. Yes. Dude, I don't know if I should be streaming this game. Not because... Not because it's dang and I mean, yeah, because it is dang and Rumpa. And when that long way the day finally came, I felt proud in a way I couldn't really put into words. I felt like I had just become part of something greater than myself. Does it make sense? Actually, that's exactly what it was like. It was truly in a dream. It's Hope's Peak Academy. This place was so much more than a school to me. Kids who look to play baseball will long to join the major leagues. Kids who look to play soccer will long to join a rep team. Ever since I was a kid, I felt the same way about Hope's Peak Academy. This is the same as the first game. If you come here and manage to graduate, you'll be set for life. current high school student and you must be the very best at what you do. There aren't any entrance exams at this academy. The only way to get in is if school scouts you to sell that to I don't read it. Maybe because of talents of those who are chosen, the students are probably going to ultimates. But even though I'm finally going to Hope's Peak Academy, so I desire more than anything else, the truth is my circumstances are a little different than a lot of my peers. But I guess I could put that aside for now. I'll find out soon enough and it's nothing special worth talking about, I think. Anyway, I guess I should introduce myself first. I'm not so special that I have to introduce myself. And formalities are always a little embarrassing. Well, this is what's expected. I guess that's how I should think about it. My name is Hajime Hinata. <clears throat> yeah. There's only one reason I came to Hope's Peak Academy. Because I admired Hope's Peak Academy. To me, attending Hope's Peak Academy is like being a celebrity or a superhero. I don't like him as much as uh, Makoto. In fact, instead of calling it admiration, it's more like it's always been a dream of mine. That's why, to feel like a member of society, to become someone I can be proud of, I always wanted to... What's, what's going on here? Oh no... What is this? It's a door. There's a door. Still, I need to hurry. Because I need to go inside this classroom. Need? What need? Can I? No, I should hurry. Ain't this a PSP game? Huh? Huh? Who goes there? Uh... Um... Are you feeling alright? You look quite pale. Uh, um... Hey, could you be... You're also a freshman at this school, right? Uh, then you're all... See for yourself. We're all freshmen, too. That guy's a freshman? He's 15 years old? I assume freshmen like us have been gathered in this classroom. Why don't you just come inside for now, says Byakuya Togami. Ah, yes, of course. Wait, why am I being so polite? I know they're called ultimates, but they're still high school students like me. That's right, first impressions are crucial in moments like this. I need to act more confident. 
Thus, to hide my nervousness, nervousness from the others, and while I'm trying my race, I'm cool. It steps inside, closes the door behind me, and sat in an open seat in the back of the classroom. Anyway, what just happened earlier? Ooh, my back hurt. Why am I tired? Excuse what? me? What is it? Why are we all gathered in this classroom? And no one said anything about coming here, so is there like an entrance ceremony or homeroom happening now? Says Biakuya. Hmm. Actually, we're just about to discuss that matter. all clear now. Since you're the last student to arrive, let's start the discussion. System. Oh my god, I have to play this game at loud. <laughs> there are only 16 guests in this classroom, and this guy is the 16th student. Such ignorance. It's obvious if you bother to think about it. Mm -hmm. And just what are we going to talk about? reason we're all gathered here in this classroom? Hmm. First, I need to confirm something out of everyone here. Is there anyone who actually remembers how they came to this classroom? Eh? Eh? I see. Everyone here is in the same predicament. No matter how you look at it, it's unnatural. Even you stupid looking ones would agree, right? What's going on? It sure is strange. Nobody actually remembers how they came here. Hey! What do you mean, stupid looking? So, in other words... Is this the same voice actor as normal Byakuya? The moment you set foot on campus, you felt a strange dizziness. And now you're here, and you don't know why. <laughs> this is what I experienced before I arrived here. Am I correct in assuming it's true of all of you? That happened to me, too. Huh? Eh? That dizziness wasn't just me? Everyone felt the same dizziness? That's weird. <laughs> Even if it's just a coincidence, it feels too good to be true. Naturally. So what you're saying, it's not a coincidence. Huh? Thing. So in other words... Meaning we can only speculate who's responsible for this strange phenomenon. Who's responsible? What is it? It feels like this is going to get even stranger. <gasps> ha! I don't know what you're so worried about, but that doesn't sound like a huge deal. Huh? What do you mean? So what I mean is... I mean it's a minor problem. Instead of trying to figure out why we're here, we should try to figure out why we can't leave. Huh? What do you mean we can't leave? Impossible! Eh? Seriously? I watched him rush over the door and try to open it. It's all of my book. Huh? It won't open. I can't open it. Huh? Huh? Why? <coughs> a little while after I got here, I tried to leave to go take a shit. But that door wouldn't budge at all. Hey! Hey! Hey, what's going on? Sheesh! Even with all my mind, I couldn't open it. I'd be absolutely impossible for you. Can I? She's right, it's impossible. Because when I went through the door, it opened normally. It wasn't locked at all. Hmm. Though I don't understand what forces are at work here. Anyway. There's no denying that we've been locked inside this classroom. Locked inside? Well, what do you mean? I suddenly became aware of how heavy my body felt. 
as though a feeling of unspeakable dread began settling on my shoulders. Are we screwed? We were getting mixed up in something dangerous. This is... Talk to Chiaki. However... According to Hope's Peak Academy, no such entrance exam exists. What? They say that publicly it is possible that this is actually a special entrance, entrance That's exam. That's wrong! You're wrong, this is not an what? entrance exam. Hey, bastard! Hey, fat ass, why'd you make that cutesy voice all of a sudden? Hmm. I won't dispute you of your blunt remark about my weight, but that voice you just heard was not mine. Huh? Then whose um, was it? Actually, it's mine. Perhaps. It sounds like a camera behind the teacher's desk. Hello. So cute! Cute! What is that? Um, it looks like a stuffed animal. That's right! I am a squeezably soft stuffed animal! Magical Miracle Girl Usami, a.k.a. Usami. I may not look like it, but I am your squeezably soft teacher. Nice to meet you all! Thank you, Usami. You're so adorable. Huh? huh? Am I hallucinating? Am I the only one who's seeing this? What's going on? Nah, I see it too. Huh? What's with all this chalk talking chihuahua? Ah! That's a chihuahua? Everyone! Does everyone here know what a rabbit is? It's a lovable animal that's very fluffy and soft. <laughs> That's what I am, a singing, dancing, talking rabbit mascot. Huh? Hold on, let me process this first. Um. Hm. It's probably remote control or something. Don't act like such a pussy over a child's hmm. food. Stop talking. Come on. Hello, Miss Rainy Days. It seems you know something about our current situation. Leave it to me! Of course I do. I'm the lead teacher of this school trip. What did you say? School trip? Come on. Hey, what do you mean, school trip? Thanks for following. <laughs> a large group of students go on a chaperone trip with the lead teacher. That's the biggest event of the school year. We're not looking for such a literal answer. Ding, 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 ding. Now let's depart for the fun school trip. Depart. Ah, oh, jeez. Look, we're already there. <laughs> we're already at the school trip. Goodbye, despair. Huh? Huh? I couldn't believe my eyes. Not just my eyes, but my brain, too. The world just stopped making sense. The classroom collapsed like a stage set, and what appeared before me instead was blue sky, white clouds, blue sea, what? white waves. What the hell is, is this? No matter how I tried to rationalize it, it was abnormal. Really unreasonable. Utterly crazy. Blatantly wrong. Dude, Hajime sucks. Um. Huh? Are you kidding me? Everyone, please stay calm. <laughs> There's no reason to panic. See, look around. Feast your eyes on this beautiful ocean. It's like your heart is being washed clean, isn't it? Hajime does not suck. People say that Makoto sucks. I think Hajime sucks. Hold on. Hold on. Give us the details. Where in the world are we? Um. Where are you asking? Well, obviously we're. <laughs> 
Out where it's better, out where it's wetter. Ta-da! Out by the sea. <laughs> I understand this is the sea, but what are we doing here? Um... You know, your throat's gonna get hoarse if you keep screaming like that. Something like this. But we're just at school and now we're at the sea. It's impossible. No problem. Please do not worry. The school trip has just started, that's all. Uh-huh. Hold on a sec. But, like, why are we on a school trip all of a sudden? We totally skipped all the stuff that comes first. Sh she's right. We're all supposed to be attending Hope's Peak Academy. I see. Ah, Hope's Peak Academy. I see, I see. You don't say. You guys are feeling unsure about Hope's Peak Academy. Then, in that case... Alrighty! Please forget about Hope's Peak Academy. That's why we're having a school trip in the first place. Bastard! The hell you mean we should forget about it? Come on. Hey, what are you? What are you scheming? Wha? What? I'm not scheming anything. I'm just doing this for everyone's sake. I'm praying from the bottom of my heart that hope will grow within everyone's heart. No problem. There's nothing dangerous on this island whatsoever. So please, there's no need to worry at all. Wait. Island? Did you just say island? Ta-da! Yep, and it certainly is beautiful. It was prepared just for us, an island free from other people in danger. Are you saying this island is uninhabited? Could it be? Perhaps you brought us to this uninhabited island to make us kill each other? Uh... Oh. Wah, wah, wah? Kill each other? Yes! Uh-uh, no way! Bloody business like causing violence or inflicting pain is a big no-no on this island. Even the word kill, just saying it horrifies me. Yeah. yeah! So scary! What are you thinking? Then what is this school trip you mentioned? What do you intend for us to do on this island? Alrighty, I shall announce it to everyone right now. While you all relax on this island paradise, you must get along and strengthen your bonds with one another. That is the main role in this heart-throbbing school trip. What did you say? Huh, heart-throbbing school trip? That's right! Yeah, spend these peaceful and relaxing days nourishing hope and lazing about, free from pain, free from suffering. Truly, this lovey-dovey heart-throbbing school trip is... Everyone's homework! What? What the hell does that even mean? Now then. Let the heart-throbbing school trip begin! Thank you. Thank you for talking for me. I wish this entire game was voiced so I wouldn't have to talk. Because the more I talk, the more stuffy my nose gets for some reason. I couldn't follow her words at all. And then just like that, like a curtain slowly lowering, my mind ground to a halt. Yay! Hajime. Chiaki. Sonia. See, I have to remember the names. Akane, Owari. I. What? I can't read their names like that. Welcome to Dangan Island. Who lives? <laughs> I can't read their names when they're sideways like that. Is is Chiaki this game's uh Kyoko? Hey, can you hear me? Are you okay? You seem pretty out of it. To be honest, I'm also no, everyone else feels the same too. Since we suddenly got put in this weird situation. Hey, are you listening? Hey, it's Hajime. <laughs> it's not his name. Leave me alone. There's no way I can leave someone alone when they took look that pale. 
white sandy beach, crystal blue ocean, the sun's rays beaming down on me, the soft tropical wind brushing my skin. I definitely don't know what's going on. I was supposed to attend Hope's Week Academy. Why did this? Why am I here at a place like this? The rabbit thinks that we're on a tropical island. You're right. Yeah, you're right. Beautiful ruin. Summer. Salt. It's the only thing I can say with absolute certainty. Welcome to Dangan Island. I will explain the basic controls. With the mouse, you can move, maneuver the reticle on the screen. If the reticle responds, press the left mouse button. And you can examine the person or object. Also, you can lift, you can shift your point of view with the WASD keys. Plus, if you press the tab key, you can use a mysterious power to see everything you can examine. Which sure has become super convenient if you're able to do all this from the get-go. Now then, please search this beach thoroughly and progress the story. I guess it makes sense for there to be palm trees on a tropical island. That's a mighty fine palm tree, but now it's not the time to be impressed by it. Can I? What's what's the button? What's Surveillance camera? Are we being monitored or something? That's not it. I wouldn't say we're being monitored. I think we're just being watched for our safety. <laughs> the ocean. The crystal clear, shining blue sea. It's perfect for a tropical island. What's going on here? I never wanted anything like this at all. Hello? A monitor? Why is there a monitor at a place like this? The screen is blank. What's it being used for? Hey. How are you feeling? Are you calm down now? I understand your confusion after everything has happened. Well, I'll start with an introduction. Introduction? I'm Nagito Komaeda. I'm nice to meet Nagito you. Komaeda. Wait, is this Makoto's voice actor? I guess I'll also tell you about my talent so you know why Post Peak Academy chose me. Even if I tell you, in my case, it's a pretty disappointing talent. Disappointing talent? What do you mean? I'm lucky. I'm lucky. What are you talking about? That's not it. That's my actual talent. I'm the ultimate lucky student. At least that's what I'm called, anyway. Ultimate lucky student? You're right. Through a countrywide lottery, apparently only one ordinary student is selected at random to attend. Hope Seek Academy as the ultimate lucky student. And that lucky winner just so happened to be me. Chosen by a lottery, is that really okay? I mean, is lucky even a real talent in the first place? How strange. Oh, what I'm not troubled or anything. <laughs> no, it's fine. I have mixed feelings about this too. Someone like me. This has to be Makoto's voice actor. It sounds just like him. At first I declined. I told them I didn't deserve it, but they told me they really wanted me to attend. Apparently the so-called luck of mine is a talent that even the school doesn't fully understand. To research it, the school picks the ultimate lucky student every year through an annual lottery. <laughs> Hope Peak Academy is amazing if they can actually research something as vague as luck. Dude, Nagito should be the freaking protagonist. I mean... He's in freaking fingers in his ass Fridays or Sundays or whatever. Thanks to that luck, a guy like me was able to attend Hope's Academy. I'm great. This is troubling. But on the other hand, I feel a little bit out of place here. Hey. Now then, it's your turn. I'm Hajime Hinata. Mm. What is your ultimate talent? I, I open my mouth, but words cannot form. I felt my thoughts stalling in my head, as if I opened a book expecting to find words, and instead found blank pages. It was kind of a comfortable feeling. The memory I was trying to recall had completely vanished from my mind. Huh? Without realizing it, realizing it my body began to shudder as waves of discomfort began pounding against me. What happened? Ah, it's nothing. I guess I'm still pretty confused about all this. I'm having trouble remembering some things.
I understand how your memory might be confused after suddenly getting into a situation like this. <laughs> I'm sure you'll remember soon once you've settled down. So I don't think you need to worry about all that much. You're right. Yep. Then I guess we're done with our introductions for now. Even though I don't know what's going on, I hope we can get along. I got a hope fragment? What the fuck? What's that weird sound? I just stuck my hand in my pocket. That's right, the strange mechanical sound is definitely came from inside my pocket. What the hell is this? It's like a PDA or smartphone. Why is something like this inside my pocket? Are you okay? Usami was passing that out earlier, remember? <laughs> No, no, you wish not. I kind of remember. What's this? Ding, 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 ding. <gasps> my my tummy is full. Full of food. It's an e handbook. What the? Where'd you come from? I'm sorry. Oh, did I startle you? I'm terribly <laughs> sorry. Hee hee hee, I know how to apologize to a good girl. Um... Don't you think it's cool? That handbook is absolutely vital for the school trip, so make sure you don't lose it. Is this device that I important? Shall explain. I've asked everyone to use their e-handbook to gather all of the hope fragments. Hope fragments? That's right! Um, on this island you'll obtain hope fragments as you get along with your classmates. As your relationship with everyone improves, you'll be able to gather more and more hope fragments. Gather hope fragments so that the flower of hope achieves its full bloom. Truly, that is the main purpose of the school trip. She's gone. If it's an animal that moves, talks, and also appears wherever and whenever she wants. Relative guy is actually controlling it. It still doesn't make any sense. And what was all that about hope fragments? What's her deal? It's like we're in a game or something. <laughs> Yep. I think it's best you introduce yourself to them. Where did everyone go? Maybe there's one island as well. Explore hey. the island. Live on this island. We should learn as much as we can about it. What's the island's name? Is there a way to escape? What about food and living arrangements? <laughs> All right. Let's go, Komida. What happened? What kind of nightmare is that? Hey. Okay, I'm about to the island. Here's the map of this island with the song of this e handbook. If you use this, you'll be able to find everyone easily. Actually, to be honest, before I arrived at the school, I did some research about everyone on the internet. He's Makoto. I haven't learned about everything about everyone, but I'm pretty sure I can give you some helpful info. You can research stuff like that on the internet? Hey, you don't know? The school's so popular, there are message boards online dedicated to talking about its students. And was I also? How unexpected. Yep. When the reticle responds, you can go inside places by pressing the left mouse button. Or use it by number you can open. Have your very own pet? My pet!
Rocket Punch Market, Airport Beach. Let's, uh, oh my goodness. Beach. Central Island. Hajime. Another island not far from here. <laughs> this is what we're going to find out, right? It's not safe when we're here, what will you do? Central Island. What's the... What's going on here? I see a bridge in this and it looks like there's a cave blocking it. Oh boy. <gasps> My eggy! Oh, so cute! It's so cute! I can give my little guy presents. Nothing. We're just sprinting. We sprint. It's pretty. I wish I could open the options. Like. System. Option. There we go. It's a little loud. Wait, where's the thing? What the? What the? This is the park. This is. Park surrounded by the ocean. <laughs> hmm, it feels so nice. If we went in a situation like this, I'd probably enjoy some lazy sunbathing myself. If being the keyword. A level assigned to you, yeah. It's displayed in the in the top right corner of my screen. If your level increases by performing various actions such as walking. Examining and talking to others every time you level up, you'll be stronger than you were before. The number of skills you can equip will also increase, so please try your hardest to level up often. What do you want? What do you want? This guy's presence is overwhelming. He doesn't seem very approachable. Even his body is hey. overwhelming. <laughs> ah, Byakia, you have time for a small introduction? <laughs> introduction? Come on, Hajime. My name is Byakuya Togami. Ultimate affluent progeny. <laughs> I'm done. That's it, right? Th this isn't Byakuya. Hmm. Actually.
How admirable. It's the only thing you skinny types are good at, it seems. <laughs> it's a bronze statue of various animals, plus it's pretty huge. Amazing! What a grand statue! Yeah, it's grand, but it isn't also kind of creepy. What? You think so? I think it looks splendid. I mean, look at it. It probably symbolizes the whole island. Sure is grand. Another monitor. Yes. Dude, I'm playing Dingle Rampo. I'm playing Dingle Rumpus. Just go! Paniola Ranch. Usami uh. Corral. This looks like a ranch. But there aren't many animals around. Right? Ah, oh, you found it out. You again? Seriously, where do you keep appearing Hi. from? I can show up from anywhere, anytime. This just allows me to appear anywhere on the island. Ta -da! It's all things as handy dandy magic stick. It's still loud. Remember that toy she's holding? Uh. I still am quite troubled. Ranch without any moo cows is like a soccer team without any balls. You might want to rephrase that. Alrighty. Just leave it to me and my handy dandy magic stick. Not it. Nah, it's probably some sort of trick or illusion. I bet it was set up before we got here. She's probably trying to make us happy, but I guess it had the opposite effect on you, Hajime. The chicken can't just change into a cow. Messing with living things like that is not cool, you know? Bird. What kind of trick is turning it into a cow? Usami Corral. Squish! Squish! Uh, what's this kid doing? She's sitting down and keeps pressing her finger into the floor with all of her strength. Are you okay? I haven't introduced myself, right? My name is Hajime Hinata. Hmm? Hmm? I'm Hiyoko Sayanji. Hiyoko Sayanji. Ultimate traditional dancer. Squish, squish. Actually, 
As a rookie, the Japanese dance industry expects a lot from her. She's already performed overseas many times. It seems her performances are popular among young audiences, which is the rare in the Japanese dance industry. Well, then again, her fans are mostly men. It's probably because she looks so young. Her fans probably have all the same niche or something. Uh-oh. What exactly are you doing? I'm squishing. Squishing what? Those are ants, duh. She's squishing. <laughs> <laughs> hey you! I knew it. Yep. Sure is peaceful. <laughs> Hey, who are you dudes? It's nice to finally meet you. I'm Hajime Hinata. Gotcha, who's the other dude? What? Haven't we already met? <laughs> hey, I'm sorry. I pretty much suck at remembering in names. And I've met so many interesting characters today. <laughs> I'm Nagito Kamida. If you can't, please don't forget my name again. Yo, the name's Yo. Akane Owari. Nice to meet ya. Okay. Ultimate gymnast. How can she be the ultimate gymnast? Well, Those two things. Right there. Her basics and fundamentals are all over the place, so her gymnastic routines are mostly improvised. She's in her groove, she performs splendidly, but if she's not, she'll lose interest and switch the up. How self centered. No matter how you cut it, she definitely sounds like a troublemaker. Even so, she's called the ultimate gymnast for a reason, so her performances must be amazing to see. Can't visualize her as a normal high school student. I mean, she got a physique of an Olympic athlete. What? Huh? Don't tell me you. Don't expect it. <laughs> yeah. You're being really loud. Hotel. I'm not ready to go to hotel yet. So this is the supermarket. It's pretty big. We're on tropical islands. That mean we're on in international waters. You're right. Thanks to this place, you don't need to worry about food and other necessities for a while. For a while. Wow. This is just a figure of speech. But there's no guarantee anything in here is edible. What if all this stuff is poisoned? What? You certainly are the skeptical type. Of course I am. Even the supermarket is strange. Look around, we're in this gigantic supermarket and there's nobody here except us. Hmm. Well, that can't be helped. Didn't you saw me say this I island is uninhabited? It's, uh, 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 it's nothing. It's nurse mommy. She's staring at me funny. Um. You know. I'm sorry. Oh no. Hajime. <laughs> my, my name is Mikan Sumiki. Um, from the bottom of my heart, I hope we can get along. Ultimate nurse. Well, um, I... you know, um, um, um. My mind is drawing a blank from nervousness. I went through all the trouble of preparing 5,000 different topics to discuss after introductions. <laughs> ah! 
Is he putting more pressure on her? Ah, Mikan, Mikan is the ultimate nurse. If you're getting injured, you need her help. So it's best if you get along with her now. If you get wounded and don't treat it, there's a good possibility you'll get an infection and die. <laughs> I'm sorry for laughing so suddenly. It's just I can't help it. I'm so happy. I can't remember the last time I made any friends. I'm sorry. Uh, not that you actually want to be friends with me. I'm so sorry. I said something so presumptuous. I'll do anything you say. Just please don't hate me. Man. Please take me seriously. Bullying a girl. Not cool, Hajime. Seriously, why does this keep happening? I'm sorry. I'm so, so, so sorry. Mono Ma. Cola. This one's a big cola bottle. I bet it go flat before you didn't finish drinking it. It's a surfboard. I'm being sent around in the mood for water sports. Me neither, dude. Those are military goods. They even carry night fishing goggles. Can't believe the supermarket even sells stuff like this. Hi, who are you? She's one of those random XD girls. I'm Hajime Hinata. Your tension is super low. Are you feeling alright? Oh. Ah, that's right. The introductions are a go-go. Buki, Mio, Da. Put it together and what do you get? Ibuki, Mio, Da. Cringe. Ultimate musician. Introductions are finished. More importantly, check out this bombastic supermarket. I see. They I got see. hamburger, ramen noodles, chili beans, bratwurst, pizza, pizza, melon. No problem. Americans, Chinese, Mexicans, Germans, Italians, and even people from Ubari would shop here. Yahoo! Man, I'm getting hella stooked. I'm 31 flavors of stoked for all this deliciousness. <laughs> That sounds familiar. Um, Sayaka? Oh my my! <laughs> Guitar! Van Gogh? Why is she so nervous? Let's go to the next place. The airport. Airport. an airport right so those things over there must be airplanes can we use those as a place to escape this uh. island nah that's impossible if they were damaged I could fix them but it looks like these planes are just for show just for show man these engines have been completely removed nothing I can do about that
Who's doing this? How did they do it? The more I think about it, the less sense it makes. That's right! That reminds me, you and me haven't been introduced yet, right? Name's Kazuichi Soda. I'm the ultimate mechanic. Nice to meet ya. Kazuichi Soda. Why he looked like a shark? <laughs> a savant. Hey. Even so, to actually remove the engine, whoever's keeping us here must have planned this to a T. You think so too, huh? Doesn't this seem pretty strange to you? That was close. Yeah, it's pretty strange, but I think it's an acceptable level of strange, you know? Huh? I mean... But I think about it, it's not like we're being forced to do something dangerous uh. or anything. I was mentioned in the safety precautions for this school trip. Remember the school trip guidelines are written in the e-handbook? Extreme violence is prohibited on this island. Please live peaceful and relaxing lives with your fellow students. Be considerate of each other and work to together to remain obtain home fragments. Littering is not allowed, but it's coexist with this island's bountiful nature and mutual prosperity. The lead teacher cannot directly interfere with the students. An exception to this rule is made if any student violates a rule. This is like the opposite of the other game. For now. Hmm. Spend these people in the last thing days nourishing hope. You saying you believe what this thing told us? What is that thing moving in the background? Oh, it's freaking baggage. Don't be such a pessimist. You should look at this situation with a bit more hope, you know? <laughs> Essential. People live satisfied lives. That's right! Well, I guess it's okay if we just enjoy our vacation and see how this whole thing plays out, right? <laughs> A plane's engine. Do they want to keep us here that badly? It's Gundam. If you value your life, do not come any closer. Huh? Fine. Hmm. I said stay back. Oh, very well. I shall accept that courage of yours. What's this guy talking about? <laughs> Would you like to know my name? Others may see your courage as recklessness. However, I welcome it. Listen well. In honor of your courage, I shall reveal you in my name. May you never forget it as long as you live. You may call me Gundam Tanaka. Remember it well, for it is the name that will one day rule this world. Hello? Ultimate Breeder. <laughs> rule this world? Let me ask. Now then, it is my turn to ask you questions. Whose master are you? You! Which tribe did you make your pact with? Answer me. What do you mean, pact? Burn in the fires of pandemonium! Answer me now. Though I shall cast you into a watery grave once you do. <laughs> it's best if I don't answer. Perhaps... Face your powerlessness! Kneel! My name is Gundam Tanaka! Oh look, there they are. There are his hamsters. Supreme Overlord of Ice. This is the Tanaka Empire! me evil by using myself as a bed. Truly, this is the secret heart of the Tanaka Empire. <laughs> he 
He's the ultimate breeder. <laughs> One of my four dark divas of destruction. Mirage Golden Hawk. Jump P has this to say. We're not used to going easy on our enemies. So don't make us angry. You wouldn't like us when we're angry. That's the Hulk. Those hamsters are so cute. And that's why Gundam is my favorite character in Gangaropa 2. Goodbye Despair. Cause he hamsters. He hamsters. Here's where the rest of the freaking cast is. Wow, this is a pretty nice hotel. Perhaps. Hotel Mirai, huh? Looks just like it's named from the Japanese word future. I'm glad. We can live in a grand hotel like this. I don't think we'll have to worry about being comfortable. Comfort is an option here. We don't even know why we're being forced to live inside. How can you accept this? You're way too excited about living hey. here. Well, it seems obvious that this area would make for a good base. Why don't we look around for a bit? map will be displayed if you press the tab key I said the tab key don't make me repeat myself ooh we're in first person mode now this cottage seems like a makeshift hotel guest room can I go inside So I live next to Soda, Byakuya, quote unquote Byakuya. Where am I going? I leveled up. I'm glad. Dude, Hajime is short. That's right, you haven't told me your name. Oh, my name? I am the ultimate team manager, Nekomaru Nidai! Nekomaru? Um, hello, I'm Hajime Hinata. Your voice is too soft! Hold it right there, your voice is too soft. Let me let your voice rise from the bottom of your stomach. I'm Hajime Hinata. Do it again. Hajime Hinata, nice to meet you, your ladies. I am Nekomaru Nidai! Is he taking a shit? <laughs> He's shitting? Yep. He led some high school rugby team full of delinquents to victory in the national playoffs. He also rescued a baseball club on the verge of being shut down and led them to national victory as well. Rumor has it he's even training that famous Japanese pitcher who plays in the American League. <laughs> I 
with the build like his, he'd better he'd be better off playing on a team instead of managing it. And that's for truth. Butterflies. Butterfly. Who the hell are you? Don't talk about sending a shit to me, dumbass. Why you? What are you looking at? You got something you want to say, bastard? Now, now. Relax, for you, Hiko. We're only here to introduce ourselves. Huh? Introduce yourselves. Hey. You've been traveling to introduce each other, have you? Right. Name's Fuyuhiko Kuzuryu. Just so we're clear, I don't plan to act friendly and shit with you guys. Ultimate Yakuza. Even though he's got a baby face, he's also incredibly rude. Um. Yep. Who's Ryu Clan is the largest criminal syndicate in the nation with a membership surpassing 30,000. How admirable. Which means he's the ultimate Yakuza. The heir to a Yakuza clan, and it's the Yaku Yakuza Ryu clan, no less. Actually. By the way, mentioning his baby face around him is expressly forbidden, so you better be careful. You'll run out of fingers before he's done with you. <laughs> hey, bastard! How about you dumbasses make like a tree and fuck up? <laughs> Dude, he's short, too. Hey! Hey, aren't you the guy who was squatting on the beach early and burying your face in your arms? Uh, yeah. You are a boy, right? Hey, you gotta keep it together, you know? At times like this, the bo it's the boy's job to keep the girl safe. You're right. Yeah, yeah. Did you want me to introduce myself? I haven't done it yet, right? Let's see. I'm Mahiru Koizumi. I'll be counting on you from now on. Ultimate photographer. Actually, Mahiru is known as the ultimate photographer. She has a promising future as a photojournalist. I'm not an expert on photography, but I hear she's a young photographer who has won numerous awards. Me too, dude. On that note, she's known for her skill at taking pictures of people. Aww. Decent. <laughs> I'm, e I'm eager to get along with everyone so we can get off this island, but I was worried it wouldn't go well. Get off this island, what do you mean? Huh? You don't know this? What the stuff the animals? After you finish collecting all the hope fragments that you earn by getting along with everyone. This joke of a school trip will be over and we can all leave this island together. That's all we have to do when we can go home? Is that true? Did you really mean that? Jeez. Hey, you should be paying closer attention. This is like really important. Hey. Well, Hajime, now that you know this, you must feel a little relieved, right? As long as we live here peacefully, we'll be able to leave this island soon enough. So there's no reason for you to act so panicky. Even so, what's the reason? Why do we have to do something like this? I mean, go through all the effort of bringing us here so we can live together and get along. Hey, hey, sense. I may not know why we're here, but that's all we have to do to go home, and that's all there is to it. I'm glad. Tired. Overall, I'm glad I'm, it's really not that big of a deal. Not a big deal, really? So we're on a school trip without any warning, then we're taken to a place like this, and then we're told to forget about Hope's Peak Academy. He, is, he, is he sure this isn't a big deal? Hey. hey. I've been waiting for like forever, Mahiru. Hmm. Too bad. 
unreliable Hajime. You better do your best. <laughs> Got it. She's so mean. Oh, no, 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 no. This, build, this whole building is middle of a renovation project, so you cannot go inside. It's dangerous, you know. Hotel rest out rant. I'm glad. Now, now. your business I just want to introduce myself is that all right with you an introduction understood. understood I don't mind I'm Hajime Hinata nice my to meet you my name is Peko Peko Yama it is nice to meet you too Peko Peko Yama ultimate swordswoman actually it's hard to believe someone with a cute name like Peko Peko Yama could be so good with the bleed I heard she's a Kindle master and that most adult men don't even stand a chance against her. There's definitely something up with her. Her eyes are really intense. It appears. If what that rabbit said is true, we are expected to live together on this island. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. It is necessary for men and women to live together. We respect each other. Don't try anything inappropriate. <laughs> I would prefer not to kill anyone. <laughs> kill? Isn't the sword in her back made of bamboo? Yes. A miss aimed to blow can be well. fatal. One with aimed to blow can be fatal too. I'll keep that in mind. Likes bathroom smells? What is wrong with Mikan? <laughs> Fighting and meat. Dude, everyone is so short. She's 4'2". There's some girl playing an arcade game and she looks completely absorbed by it. Hajime. He was really focused on the game, but I guess he should try to talk to her. Um, excuse me, I'd like to introduce myself. Hey! Hey, Chiaki. <sighs> She's too focused on her game. Um. Let's see. Oh, right, introductions. Got it. I'm Chiaki Nanami, the ultimate gamer. Video games are my hobby, and I'm a fan of all genres. Nice to meet you. The ultimate gamer. Dude, she's a fan favorite for sure. Yep. <laughs> well, it's more like I'm the kind of person who has to gather my thoughts before I can start talking. 
Like I can't talk that well unless I've already prepared everything I want to say in my head. Especially when I'm meeting new people. Well, if I get used to them, I can usually talk a little faster. She may be the ultimate gamer, but how can she play video games at a time like this? Sleepy. Bro. Amazing! It's enormous! Hmm. Sorry. <laughs> uh oh. Sorry, I'm having a hard time. Because it's full of poison. It really sucks. Speaking of which, I'd be great if you could use your mouth to suck it out. Oh. <laughs> um. Poison, I see. Hey, do you guys have a moment? Huh? Whoa, denied. Denied? Good day. Hello there. My name is Teru Teru Hanamura. On the streets, I'm known as the ultimate cook. But could you guys call me the ultimate chef instead? It has more of a big city flavor to it, you know? Ultimate cook. <laughs> I hope we get along well. I am sorry! Oh, that reminds me of not properly introduced myself either. I'm terribly sorry to keep you waiting. My name is Sonia Nevermind. The ultimate princess. <laughs> I'm a foreign exchange student from a small European kingdom called Novo Selic. Ultimate princess. It's not just her beauty. She's just so graceful and completely at ease, even though she's a real princess. Um. This may be rude of me to say, but truthfully, I feel happy. What are you happy I... about? My home country, I did not have a single friend my age who was standing in society matched my own. So to be able to do something like this with everyone is a new experience for I me. I shall praise you. I shall extol your virtues. What the? Mm -hmm. No. <laughs> <laughs> I would be lying if I said I wasn't interested. And since I do not want to be a liar, then truthfully, yeah, I like it. Well, guess that's about it. Understand? Dude, Terra Terra needs to shut the fuck up. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I have a sneaking suspicion that Miss Pekko is actually a bit of a freak if you catch my meaning. What? Bonjour. She's probably wearing a black thong, too. What are your thoughts on that? Now then, shall we discuss this somewhere privately? Oh my god. He's extremely horny. Understand? For example, I could tell her my loins are full of poison and ask her to suck it out. Is that a school bell just now? Huh? Congratulations, 
is everyone. It appears that everyone has finished collecting the hope fragments. I'm... I'm so happy. So, I've prepared a present for everyone that'll make you all very happy. I apologize for the trouble, but please gather at the beach. <laughs> May Shining Hope be with you all. What to do? She said to me at the beach, is that going to be okay? So I have a bad feeling about this. But... I'm really worried, but it would look bad if I was the only one who didn't go. Can I teleport? Can I teleport to the beach? Such ignorance. Let me hear initial pressures of this island. That you it. I have been under numerous blocked off bridges on the central island. Oh. Those are so everybody doesn't get lost. There's also a big ranch, um. a large supermarket, hmm. <laughs> the restaurant inside the hotel was also very nice, it seemed to cater to a more plebeian taste. Hey. Can you guys listen to what I want to say too? I found something very important on the Girls! Thank you girls! Gross. <laughs> huh? Not possible. No one realized it. You're all bigger fools than I thought. Huh? Such ignorance. Yo, hang on. What's Shiaki mm. gotta say? Dude, I feel the same way, Chiaki. Damn it. You are right. Listen. Everyone, please be quiet. I have no choice but to come from be a boo boo yakasha. However, 
by how big this island is, I cannot believe it is uninhabited. Just why in the world is going on here? I suppose the truth, Byakuya. Aww. Tim Byaki runs his mouth. Fuhigi looks ready to kill him. Why do boys always have to provoke each other like that? It's because he... That's not Byakuya. Sheesh. Why, why choose Byakuya of all the characters to be... You know... In this game. Understand. Alright, Terra Terra needs to shut the fuck up. I'm sorry. <laughs> you sure talk big. Is being an affluent progeny that big of a deal? Hey, hey! You're gonna talk to me about something boring. I'm just gonna swim, okay? Why don't you just do your own thing? We saw me swimming here too. Yeah, they could have put Asahina in this game. I'm Asahina Aoi. What is it? The ultimate swimmer. I wonder what Byaki you found. This is acting so mysterious and stuff, he's probably found something big. I see. It seems everyone has explored this island. Just as the Shomi said, there seems to be no danger. <laughs> he figured out as well, you know what? You got nothing? You wish to know, let's pay my price after this world. This world is ruled by the law of equivalent exchange. Stay back. What's the most serious truth? Did you find something out about the island? Hmm. Have you all gone to the park that's across the bridge? Listen. When I saw it, I remembered a story I had heard before. There's an island in the in a Pacific Ocean, a beautiful island paradise where summer never ends. It consists of a central island surrounded by five different islands. It's also said that the five holy animals symbolize each other, symbolize each of the surrounding islands. Eh? Listen. The island's name is Jabberwock Island. Could it be? Could this island be Jabberwock Island? Is that the name of this island? Very strange. Still, there's something on my mind. In fact, according to what I've heard, Jabberwock Island is already. Hmm. Never mind. Hold on. Don't worry. Nico Nico Island or Poo Papua Island. Yahoo! <laughs> hey, you I guys. Like I can't say the same about the rest of you cretins. We're all here to attend Hope is Week Academy, right? But we're all living in an island like this instead. No matter what, it's completely weird. Why don't you stop talking for a while? Go cool your head off or something. Eh? Tell you the truth. Even if we wanted to leave, there's no way we can. <laughs> there's no ship and the plans are just for show. It appears. From what I've discovered, there's no way to contact the outside world either. In conclusion, it would be impossible for, to call for help. Um. 
Why don't we just swim home? Uh. <laughs> Nuh-uh, you can't do that. That's the biggest of no no's. Got it? Please recall the guidelines of this school trip. Littering is not allowed. Let us coexist with this island's bountiful nature and mutual prosperity. That's enough. Now, as long as you don't do anything weird, it seems there's no danger. Yep. As long as you gather hope fragments, we'll be able to get off this island soon. Hmm. There's no other choice but to believe, for now, that is. Hey, hey! Anyway, Usami, what's this present you mentioned in your announcement earlier? Whoa! Ah, that's right. Well, of course I didn't forget. Love, love. Love, love. This is it. Don't be upset. I prepared one for you all, so don't worry. What is this? <laughs> I'm Usami. Magical miracle girl Usami. I'm an itty bitty girl who's sweet like milk. Can't taint nature with trash. <laughs> See, even you think they're trash. Okay. <laughs> Usami sadly picked up the straps and looked at us with the lonely expression on her face. <laughs> Could it be? <laughs> um... A motive? Correct. Whoa. Anyway. Excuse me, Miss Sonia. <laughs> All right, Terry Terry needs to shut the fuck up. Wait. Your tenderloins, you betcha. That's. I got it. Uh. Let's kill. Let's find a hoop snake and kill it. You serious? I see. <laughs> Dude, the best mur the best way to murder someone is to just drown them and throw their body in the sea. Hajime. <laughs> 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 
There's nothing tragic waiting to happen on this island. <laughs> Talk to Chiaki. You're not gonna swim? Sleepy. I'm like really sleepy right now. Talk to Usami, who followed? HTTP Shroom? Looks like she's saying too, she's unexpected. It's more like the active type. Hey, you're not gonna swim? Huh? Of course I am, why? Why did you go with others to change? So annoying. I don't need to change, all I have to do is take off my clothes. You. <laughs> Akane. I won't forgive you! So annoying. Huh? You're not gonna swim, Hajime? <sighs> How can I get you to believe it? There's no way I can believe her. <laughs> Speaking of which, everyone has returned. Is there somebody said they turned around and saw a group of people wearing slippers jumping in the ocean starting with joy? Oh my god. Yahoo! They're all the same color. Okay, so why does... I forgot their names. Why is he wearing a Speedo? Why is he wearing trunks? Yay! The sea! Uh, the water is so cool! It feels great! But all the girls get the same... Uh, uh, too salty! This water is too salty! It's not going easy on me! Ibuki? Hey. I got some suntan lotion from the supermarket. Would anyone like a rub down? Shut the fuck up. Oh, you're quite considerate. Now then, will you apply it right away? Hey, okay. Rubbing lotion on a muscular man. All right, no problem. My tastes are pretty open, you know. <laughs> you seem a little mm. too open. Like you're covering too many bases by yourself. Mahiru. Thank you. <laughs> I'll make sure to slather you with lots and lots of oil. Oh my god. What is this feeling of intense bloodlust? Feels like a resort. There's no other way to describe it. Seeing the other students having all this fun. I, <laughs> I, yep, I'm very happy. Everyone seems to be getting along with each other, so I'm very happy. Thought this would be hard. So everyone got used to this, but they're acting like ultimates. Ding, 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 ding. Ultimate friends. <laughs> Fine, I just gotta do it, right? Then I'll do it. That's right, I'll do it. Huh? Something happened? Hey, have me one of those swimsuits. Hey, you guys! Don't forget about me! Hey, hey, wait for me! Let me join in the fun! Wait, huh? The sky grew cloudy. What is this? What's happening? These strange clouds. This doesn't look natural at all. Huh? What's going on? What did you do? This obviously not right. The sun just a few minutes ago. Hey! What is this? I didn't do anything. What is all this? There's no way something like this should be happening. At that exact moment, it suddenly happened. Is it time? Is it oh? Uh, uh, mic <gasps> check, mic it's check. time! Finally! Uh, 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 can you hear me? Can you hear me? That voice was so laid back and so gleeful that it seemed out of place. But was different than Usami's. Is it of an endless storm of malice could be felt raging behind that laid-back voice. The moment I felt it, my body shuddered. <laughs> surprised? You were totally surprised, right? Now then, sorry to keep you all waiting for so long. Let's leave all this worthless entertainment behind. There we it's go. It's time for the main attraction. You guys better hustle over to Jabberwock Park. Could it be? 
this voice? If if this is oh this is very bad, I gotta do something. I won't let you. It's all up to me. Very strange. It seems that was an unusual occurrence. Mm. It's best if we go too. Hey! Naturally. <laughs> His fucking heavy footsteps. Wasn't he just swimming? Too many Mr. Krabs. Dude, she's obsessed with killing animals. We arrived at Jabberwock Park. Usami's shouting voice can be heard ringing through the park. I won't let you. Where are you? Where are you hiding? Hiding? Who are you talking to? Hey, eh? hey. <laughs> There's that ear piercing laughter. Why, hello there! Thank you all for waiting! There he is. Long time no see, guys! I am Monokuma! I'm the headmaster of this academy! Monokuma appears! Now that I've made my dashing appearance, the first thing I'm gonna say is... Lame. This is so friggin' lame! Lame, I say. Lamer than the lamest lame sauce. <laughs> oh wait, lame sauce? Is that tasty? Hey, hey! Just as I thought it was you. But how? Why is Monokuma here? Monokuma? Silence! Aw, shut up! Hey, um. I'm livid, you know, and I'm about ready to bar fix your lukewarm attitude. <laughs> Just what's with this heart throbbing school trip crap anyway? I'm bored, so hopelessly bored. Hey! This ain't fun at all. You better knock this off, knock off this farce right now! What are you thinking? You gotta make this, you know, meet the demands of the world. Nobody wants to see high school students living in calm, peaceful lives. What everyone wants to see is <laughs> other people's misery and despair. You. What? What? What's going on here? What is that thing? I won't let you. Be careful, everyone. Stay back and leave this to me. I don't know why Monokuma is here, but as long as I have this magic stick. Yeah! My flawless. First of all, you're too plain. White rabbits are far too plain. So I'm gonna make you in my image. <laughs> this is what happens when you defy me. I'll crunch ya. I'll bite ya. I'll rip you apart. <laughs> Stop it! Hey, hold still. This wooden stick isn't gonna shove itself in, you huh? know? No! That's a no-no! That's a big no-no! Ta-da! All done! She's wearing a diaper. What? What is this? No! Change me back to normal. What's this? Big brother? Mono me? My little sister! It's Mono me. <laughs> hey! Why do I have to be your little sister? Voila. I don't like this. Ho! 
Call me Big Brother. They're playing house. Ooh. Even the display changed to mono me. I won't forgive you. Stupid fool! Do you think you can win against me? No! It hurts a lot when you punch me! Friggin' nose. It's obvious something bad is happening. Huh? What is this? What's going on? <laughs> Sob. Huh? Now she's all weird looking. What the? There's more of them? What did you say? Bear it! I'm not a tanuki, I'm a bear, I'm Monokuma. What's going on? understand it myself but a new stuffed animal appeared? I mean why is that stuffed animal even talking I'm the headmaster of Hope's Academy Jesus. Monokuma huh? did you say headmaster anyway regardless it appears everyone has gathered now then as the headmaster I shall make a formal declaration <laughs> the killing school trip shall now commence <laughs> Where everyone gets along has no stimulation. So damn boring. How long have I been playing? I've been playing for two hours already. Nobody wants to play a game hey, like that. Hey. You guys agree with me, right? Thank you for waiting. Do your best. You guys are the contestants. Right? Billing? Contestants? I won't forgive you. Ah! Oh! It hurts a lot when you kick me, too. Ronnie's such a dumb child. Pay attention to Simex to the manga. A little sister is never smarter than her big brother. <laughs> <laughs> what are you saying? Isn't it obvious you guys are gonna kill each other? No. Well, kill each other, I see. Are you kidding me? Kill each other? No way, no way, no way! It's impossible! No! Yeah if you want off this island, please kill one of your friends. I'm gonna make it through the class trial without getting caught. <gasps> class trial. That's right. So the class trial will be the real charm of this killing school trip. Allow me to explain. In other words, you will be punished. <laughs> what the heck? Hmm. That is execution. The pleasing punishment that follows the class trial. This is one of the perks of the killing school trip. <laughs> what sort of spine tingling punishments will we see? I can't help it. I'm already getting excited. There may even be some unique punishments, like impaling you through the head with a thigamajig claw. Hmm. Any method of killing is fine. Popular ones like bludgeoning, stabbing, strangling, and poisoning. To shooting, beating, running over, burning, bombing, slashing, drowning, electrocution, crushing, cursing. Shing! Please choose whichever killing method you prefer. No time limit, so you can kill as you please. It's an all-you-can-murder buffet. The theme park of murder. That's awesome! 
awesomely poptastic! Damn it. Don't fuck That's with right. me. That's right, who on earth would kill someone? No way! No, no! I won't believe. I won't believe. What's going on? Who knows? Anyway! What's going on? What's this? Hold on! I have no idea! I'm gonna do it! What? A fight? Do I need to beat the crap out of that black and white bear? Let's go. Who would dare try to kill but put a stop to the force if necessary? Why you? You keep saying stupid stuff. The athletes in our group are gonna lose their patience. Fine, fine. What the hell? <gasps> what is this? Why did the statue Wrong. move? It's no statue, they're mono beasts. <gasps> Monster? Hey. Stranger Magic was surprised that when it happens, your voice won't let you express it. I was forced to accept that. Sudden appearance of a monster might be normal in animated video games. It's impressive why I couldn't grasp the reality of the situation. This is a video game. No! This can't be, it's just too weird. Don't tell me. Am I having a nightmare or something? A nightmare, he says. He just admitted his brain is a total flower patch. Unbelievable. <laughs> I don't like this. Everyone. I can't lose. Ha! Let's go! It's punishment time! Uh oh. Oh, my God. No, mono me. Oh my god. It's only the first stage of mono me is already dead. What? Is that a demon or perhaps it's a weapon from the future? <laughs> the reality was very lethal at this particular moment. <sighs> That's right, this is what I wanted. Feelings of despair, giving an example was totally the right call. Unlike the exuberantly laughing Monokuma, we were completely frozen. As though we'd forgotten to breathe. We just stood there, horrified. We were powerless, no different than ants washed away in a storm. Well, now. now then I believe I've made my point. 
just so we're clear, you guys can't defy me. If you don't want to end up as fish food, you better not disobey me. Just so you know, I don't feel mercy or sympathy. Because I'm a bear after all. An excuse like, I got high off this tropical atmosphere. Won't work on me at all. Hmm. I've already updated the e-handbook. <laughs> Truth bullets. How's my pet doing? Still no presents. Once a murder takes place, a class trial will begin shortly thereafter. Participation is mandatory for all surviving students. If the black end is exposed during the class trial, they alone will be executed. If the black end is not exposed, the remaining students will be executed. As a reward, the surviving black end will be forgiven of the crime and allowed to leave the island. A body discovery in Aspen Place. There's three more people discover a body for the first time. Destroying any property on this island without permission was, is expressly prohibited. This includes the surveillance cameras and monitors who are free to investigate this island or discretion. Actions in this regard are not limited. Additional scripture moves may be added at the headmaster's discretion. Everyone else looked the same. We had little tail, pale, tired That's expressions on our faces. Um, I won't believe. I won't believe. <laughs> It'd be one thing if we were up against a human or even an animal. <laughs> what the hell can we do against a monster like that? What's going on? It's impossible. Why is something impossible happening? It's certainly well, possible. Well, it's not really impossible. Those monobies or whatever they're called. Our machines, thus Monokuma, must also be the same. As long as they're machines, it means someone made them and is controlling them. Then... Who could be responsible? Why are we put in this unexplainable situation? Answer me! Hey, who is it? Who? Ah. Uh, <laughs> could be anyone. It's not like... I believe it anyway. There's no way I'd believe something like that. Anyway... More importantly, are you guys hungry? Let's stop thinking about this and just eat. Oh. You can eat first. Listen. I'm how confused you are. I don't mind. However, remember this. Uh, I don't know who in the world is orchestrating this, but we don't need to be cautious. We don't need to be cautious of the machines or whoever even who's controlling them. More than anything, we must be cautious of each other. Ourselves. Fat Byakuya. Being brought to a tropical island with complete strangers in order to kill each other to escape. That creates fear in our minds, and the desire to escape that hopeless fear is our worst enemy. We looked around at each other's faces. It was obvious from looking at their expressions. Everyone was forced to admit the truth of what he just said. We had to be honest with ourselves and admit that we has also had that potential. Only a student who kills a classmate can escape this island. Which means in order to escape this hopeless situation, we must sacrifice a person. However, there's a possibility that killing may never occur, but even I'm no different. How can I be truly confident that something like this isn't going to happen? No, there's no way I can know for sure. This nightmare of visitation won't have to be... 
That's why it felt so hopeless. I don't know. This this cast of characters just doesn't seem as good as the first cast. Honestly. Special day. A day of despair. It, this is goodbye despair. Here we go. Yes, it's starting. Yes. Her name's Peko Peko Yama. I bet Fat Biaki is gonna be a, uh, a victim. We did it, we beat the prologue. We did it, we beat the two hour long prologue. The faux show broken wand. Wow. Yes, I would. I just read these. I sat on the beach paralyzed with thought. No matter how much I didn't want to believe it, the moment I experienced and felt for myself, I became undeniably real. This is a reality that could not be more different than from my usual daily life. School, studying, exams, job hunting, going for walks, going to school, riding the train, lectures. That kind of daily life is no longer mine. As I looked up, I saw stars glimmering in the night, covering the sky like a sheet. It looked as if they were about to fall into my hands like fluttering snow. Yeah. I don't know, the characters themselves are good, right? I feel like them put together as a as an ensemble just doesn't fit as well. My heart was horribly upset. That kind of beauty was definitely far different from my usual daily life. Chaper Wan. 
Destination Despair. Shaper Twop. <laughs> Executive Committee has an announcement to make. It is now 10 p.m. Nighttime can be confusing. If you're out at night and accidentally meet a killer, then it sucks to be you. But if you're worried about that and can't sleep, I've prepared a cottage on the hotel grounds for each of you. Every single one of you, please feel free to rest in your own rooms. However, before you go to bed, I strongly recommend you lock your doors. You never know who might be planning to kill you. <laughs> bye bye. A cottage, huh? Slightly increases the influence gauge effective during class trial. Cannot be combined with envious influence. Increases influence gauge recovery. Slightly steadies your aim, effective during not and stop debate. Reduces your aiming speed. Increases the speed of memorizing a statement. Son of Sparta. Thanks for following. Get lost in thought. No problem for the follow, bro. This dislikes 
pretty thing. I mean, likes pretty things and just like noisy places. Dude, I it's me. He's me. I'm Nagito. Likes games, even crappy games. Dude, everyone in this game is so short. Like squish squishy. Lecture, sour stuff. Um Where's Terror Terror? Four three? Why is everyone so short? Likes mama. Dislikes junk food. <laughs> Likes freshly washed towel. I need to take a short little break real quick because I've been playing for two hours. Two hours. This is nice. It's a lot nicer than the freaking school. With the freaking bolts on the windows. I let out a scream. Ah! Why me? Why do I have to go through with this? Ah. Yeah, I'm losing my voice too, actually. This game is much prettier. It is! I, s I said I don't like the ensemble cast. I mean, I like the characters individually, but like, when they, when you put them all together, I don't feel like they fit very well. When can I st when can I stop? <laughs> like, <laughs> when can I take a break? I think the characters are much better in this one than Trigger Happy Havoc. Maybe. I don't know much about these characters. I'll give the keynote addresses right now. From now on, I promise to be charmed by this world. So make sure you get excited, immerse yourself in the heart dropping action during your content. Until the very end. Please enjoy this game to the fullest! This game is just reading non-stop. I need water. Ahem! Hope Speak Academy School Trip Executive Committee has an announcement to make. Good morning, everyone! Looks like today is going to be another perfect tropical day! Now then, let's show some enthusiasm and make sure to give it our all today! No, no, no. <laughs> You're not allowed to go out. Why are you no here? No way! Okay, I'll be right back. You can watch Chibini.
fucking bad. Ooh, that's loud. Hey, um... Find my stuffed animals. Phew. If you please. Look for Monokuma dolls? Anyways, how are we doing? I went and changed the laundry. Yo, hang on. I still think the music's too loud. <laughs> too bad. Well, all right, so I have to find the Monokuma doll. What's up, Virgil, son of Sparta? What is this? A shelf? Oh, it's up there. Huh? I've been found. Mon hidden Monokumas. Well, isn't that wonderful? <laughs> I'm playing Devil May Cry while watching this. Devil May Cry? I've never played that game. So I'm going to confess something. I've never played the first game, but I know everything that happens in it. Because I've watched like five full playthroughs of that game. <laughs> but I haven't seen anything about this one. Uh, okay. Is it free time? Ah! Oh. Huh? Maybe some bias, but I, I mean, is hey. it anything like Bayonetta? Damn it! Ah. The bridge at the Central Island? This is bad. The monsters are in front of the bridges. Wrong. Ah! So cool. Wait, someone's. I just heard a knock at the door. It's my uncle at the door. My teal. Same genre of games you play Bayonetta, DMC 4 and 5 might be good for you. I don't want to spend more money on, money on games. I didn't even spend money on this game. This is a present. This is my Christmas present. Monster Stars Gatekeepers is better. I better not get close to him. Is it a game over Damn if I touch it. the Mono Beasts? Yeah, soda. Aw, man. Kazuichi soda. Hey. Ah! 
Well, obviously. Damn it! Dude, he's... Who will die? I thought everyone was waiting at the restaurant. Yep. I thought I'd get some gaming in until everyone else arrived. Mm. But I guess I should get going too. Peko best girl. Not Chiaki? Hm. Where's Kazuichi? He ran off. Huh? Pretty much said he was running away, but <laughs> running the way. There's no one to run away to. What a weirdo! Why is Hiyoko such a a b word? However, after what we witnessed yesterday, his behavior is understandable. Huh? What do you mean? Did something happen yesterday? Understand. Not yet. Not until Kazuichi arrives. <laughs> Dude. Fat Byakuya is just hilarious. Pointing! She's a good character, but I feel like I'm falling for the waifu bait with the Chiaki. Yeah, she's literally an the ultimate gamer. She's literally waifu bait. I'm gonna do it. Akane is just like angry Asahina. It's impossible. Show some spirit. Let me tell you this. And Gundam is just better Yasuhiro. That was close. Hey, hey! Akane is Goku. I used like all of my energy this morning going running. <laughs> There's probably some limit to make us feel better or something. Don't make me repeat myself. Whenever was here, we can then we can start talking. Jeez. Who will die first? <laughs> mm. I'm a little jealous now, getting tied up by Miss Mahiru. <laughs> Maybe I should run away too, just kidding. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Disgusting moron. That's fine. Two? No, that's the card, and this is the gift. Is this card all gone? There's two cards. Oh, there is. I can't even remember who dies first. I know. Let's eat. 
fat fat Biakuya. <laughs> when I arrived this morning, it was already here. <laughs> ah, they even have crab and shrimp. Aww. Crab and shrimp are such a pain to eat. I hate them as much as I hate Mikan's ugly, stuttering face. <laughs> Gross. Why is why is Hiyoko so mean? Why? <laughs> I got it. Terra Terra prepared this food, right? Ibuki. Ibuki Miyota. <laughs> Unfortunately, it wasn't me. You see, the food I make doesn't taste as shitty as this does. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Compared to the world-class dishes I make, a dish that tastes yummy would still be considered shit. Nonsense! In fact, even comparing them is out of the question. Comparing my dishes to this lowly peasant food, how rude! Yoko's my least favorite character from the series so far. Really? Understand. I'm just saying, if you guys ate my food, you wouldn't be able to control yourself. What? What does that mean? Well done. Well, let's just say your jaw wouldn't be the only thing that drops. There's no mistaking it. In fact, your panties would drop too. What did you say? He guessed correctly. However, uh, if Terra Terra did not prepare this food, then the one who did uh. is could it have been Monokuma. Is it safe to eat? Cook food cooked by something like that? Don't worry. That's why I'm tasting it for poison to make sure it is safe for consumption. <laughs> hey! You are a boy, right? My hero. Aw, oh, man. Even though you look all flashy, you're actually a big coward. Are you gonna be okay? People like you are usually the first victim, you know? <laughs> I just wanna go home already. Uh-oh. <laughs> uh, uh oh, oh no. <laughs> this is me. <laughs> Get it? Put this on Twitch. Can you even call that tripping? How in the world did you end up in such a compromising position after tripping? Well, it certainly makes me happy. I'm very happy right now. No! I'm so embarrassed. B please help me. Ah! She looks so adorable when she's embarrassed. It's so moe. I'm practically snorting with joy. We, we should help her up. Are you okay? Why is that a scene? She does this often? <laughs> hey. Um. I'm getting sleepy. Hmm. Ah, uh, ah, uh, jeez. Hajime, do you see the new rules in the Hei Handbook? Looks like this killing school trip isn't a joke after all. So, are are the three who carry everyone in this game? Nagito and Chiaki and Hajime. This is troubling. 
You know, just like freaking Kyoko and Byakuya from last game. They carried everyone while everyone else was just like, Uh, uh what does this thing do? Sorry. Looks like my fear is contagious. I'd say Byakuya would. Fake Byakuya. Fat Byakuya. <laughs> <laughs> I can't go over that. <laughs> it's just fat Byakuya. It's hard for me to move around with normal undergarments. That's the only reason. <laughs> Seems like my guess was correct. Miss Pekka was wearing a black thong. At this rate, I should make my move with Sonia, too. <sighs> Biaki a thick gummy. Hey, hey! She literally tripped over nothing. Seriously, that sort of thing should never only happen in manga. <laughs> this is manga, pretty much. No, talk to I Ibuki. Good nom nom numbing. <laughs> Ibuki's kind of annoying. Just kidding. Um... I hope Sonya lives forever. She's too precious. Oh! Chicken meat, make sure you consume as much chicken meat as you possibly can. What are you talking about? <laughs> if you want muscles, then you must consume chicken. Chicken is low in calories and high in protein. Hmm, now's not a good time. I see, no worries then. Thank you very much. I don't trust me, Kain. Is the Tanaka Empire! I trust Gundam with my life. I shall engulf this world. Hey, hey! That's enough. Lies! <laughs> Do you honestly think that is a large pile of food? You? Let me say this. <laughs> Let me say this. Do not even think about copying what I do. This much food is beyond you, lowly peasants. I'm the only one who could possibly eat this much food, for I've overcome the hardships of the past. Try saying that again. Hey. Akane, you shouldn't. If you attempt an eating competition, you'll ruin that perfect figure of yours. What? Why you? Do you have any idea how much money I spent sculpting my physique? <laughs> this shit's hilarious. Are you telling me I need to lose weight? Yeah, me too. I am sleepy. Huh? This was to hold people like you are usually the first victim remark. <laughs> as long as I lock myself in my room, there won't be any problems. Listen. First, I have a question for you all. That Monokuma thing ordered us to kill each other. So under these strange circumstances, what do you think we need right now? Who the fuck knows? Get to the point already. Don't make me repeat myself. If you want me to get to the point, you better hurry up and answer my question. Huh? What do we need? We need food and sleep, obviously, right? No! 
No, you forgot about shitting. Pay attention. How old is Nekomaru? I forgot to hmm. check his age. Hang on, let's just, let's check right now. Does it even say? Doesn't say. Why is their chest size? Everyone's so short. Literally. The only people who go above six feet are Byakuya and Nekomaru. <laughs> and Nekomaru is this game Sakura. Perhaps a bon wait, what did I what did I miss? Uh what's the transcript button? Oh, the real answer, okay. I as long as ultimates work together, this is something we can't accomplish. It's You'll be able to create a hope they can overcome any despair. That's why if we want to escape this island, we need to promise each other we'll work together. Gross. Wow, he said it with a straight face. I was not embarrassed. <laughs> I just as I figured it was kind of lame, However, huh? He does have a point. It must be why Monokuma is enforcing a rule that will cause us to be suspicious of each other. I see. That was a pretty good answer. This is impossible to face our enemies as individuals. Under these circumstances, we are going to fight as a group. <laughs> However, what we need to achieve is that solidarity is not something as easygoing and optimistic as a bond. Huh? Then what? Listen. What we need right now is a disciplined leadership. Provided by an unmistakable leader. I see. Even sports teams need Nagito's voice actor. I knew it. I knew that Nagito's voice actor was the same as Makoto's. Like, I said that at the very beginning when you started talking. That's Makoto, isn't it? Rejoice. Hmm. Hey! Wait just a second. What? Jeez. What did you say? I didn't know it your excuse me too much. Deciding to be the leader on your own, and why does this have to be you anyway? Not possible. Who is more fit to lead other than me? I'm the ultimate affluent progeny of the Togami household. That's to stand above all others. What are you saying? Seriously, I'm telling you the attitude is, uh, is too... Wait! <laughs> My hero, please wait. It's true that Byakuya may be a little forceful, but given our current situation, I believe it's a leader's duty under circumstances like this to be forceful to a certain degree. But... That may be true, but if we can need someone who can lead people, then even Sonya can. No! No, perish the thought. I'm merely a figurehead. Hey. Well, he must have the qualities of a leader if he can accept the role under these circumstances. Hmm... Everyone's okay with it. I'm okay with it too. It's all clear now. Then I guess we've made our decision. Don't worry. As long as I'm the leader, I won't let anyone become a victim. He's gonna be the first victim, isn't he? I will guide you all. Now then, let's move on to the topic at hand, for real this time. I have something to show you all. Something to show Follow us? me. Did you... <laughs> Every time he walks away, he fucking stomps. Aww. Except for Gundam, for some reason. And Let's go, Chompy, Magazi, Sandy, Champy. Oh, 
Damn it. So annoying. Gundam is a treat. Dude, he's my favorite character. Gundam is my favorite character. Wait, she's gone, but Gundam's still here. Okay. Sonia. Huh? Don't tell me you too. Me too, what are you talking about? Um... Oh, Miss Mahiru has asked me to take a leadership position. Jack is being too forceful about leading us. Doesn't that raise a red flag? Hey, hey! Please, Sonia, think about it again. Don't you think you would be a better leader instead? Um... I'm certain that I am ill suited to be one. I... By often being forceful, I really hear the quality to be an effective leader. Huh? Please listen! He's truly attempting to fill the destiny strength of his own will. <laughs> his impressive stature and physique is a testament to his desire to be the ultimate athlete progeny, you know? Um. That is truly grand. I guess that's one way of looking mm. at it. You put it like that, Sony. It does sound convincing. Hey, hey! Okay, I understand. I'm sorry for being so pushy, Sonia. No. No, it is simply. I leave that matter to your discretion. A matter of regular discretion. I don't feel like I'm playing the game. I feel mm. like I'm just watching someone else play. Even though I'm literally the one playing it. The situation is going to like change anytime soon. With Ultimate Princess decrees it. I guess Bjaki can, can be the leader. What are you doing? You should hurry over to the park. <laughs> hey! Damn it! I agree. The game doesn't really kick in until you're at the trial. Hey! And I'm not even gonna do the trial today. I'm gonna I'm gonna do the freaking investigation and quit right before the trial and then do the trial next time. Uh, Just when is the net when is the first murder? But look at that background. Where's the park? Monokuma Rock, what? Where are the freaking mono monsters? Oh my goodness. Dude, Hajime is like just it's he's so boring. Like honestly. Ooh. There it is.
I mean, like, his design is more boring than, um... Makoto's. And Kaede's. Kaede at least looks cool. Um... Ah. What? What's supposed to be here? What? Here, really? Such ignorance. If you haven't noticed yet, then I was right to dismiss you all as idiots. It's a freaking bomb. Yeah, I'll have to buy V3 after this. No! Hmm. It appears. It was Monokuma. What does this count on even mean? It's got nothing to do with me because I refuse to believe this is happening. Hold on! It better not be a bomb. Are you kidding me? A b b b b b b bomb? Not possible. This is your motive, stupid. No one dies within the 21 days. Or whatever. Everyone dies. V3, yeah, this, this is, I got this as a gift because it was also on sale. Right? A mysterious mystery, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I, just, I didn't even notice. Monomisi. I heard everyone talking while I was patrolling, so I came over. Um, um, um not that. Didn't Monokuma kill you? I see. So that's why you're surprised. <laughs> you don't have to worry about that. After all, I can never die. It appears you cannot escape. You must be an undead abomination, risen from the foulest depths of another world by black magic. <laughs> Monomy is a mechanical stuffed animal, right? Doesn't it mean she can't die in the first place? <laughs> now that you mention it, she'd only need like a spare or something. <laughs> a spare? What a mean thing to say. <laughs> you got lucky? You've arrived at the perfect time. There's something I wanted to ask. Come on. What is the meaning behind this timer and this countdown? Answer me. Hmm? Countdown. What is this? Um, I'm sorry. I don't know what this is. Hey. You really don't know? I'm sorry. Huh? That's wrong. I'm not my brother's little sister. Did she accept the role or not? Dude, there's like some really funny one-liners in this. Alrighty. Um, let's together I said get lost. Yeah. Don't be mean to mono me. Um I won't be fooled. Hey bastard. Who the fuck cares about that stuffed animal? More importantly, what the hell is that clock? Hmm. Looks ominous, doesn't it? Who put that object here? And how they do it in just one night? Hmm. I can't imagine. Hmm. Which means it doesn't make any sense. Also, it's deadly. <laughs> That's not all that's unimaginable. It's honest full of mystery mysteries that you can't even begin to imagine. For example, 
How were the 16 of us brought to this island? Hmm. <laughs> There's more. Why is Jabberwock Island, which is known for being a popular resort destination, now an uninhabited island? There's no sign of tourists or even citizens on this island. Something like that even possible? This, too, must be the will of causality. All civilizations are destined to collapse. Nothing, to, nothing but begets existence, and existence begets nothing. <laughs> so it collapsed? You are right. Society is much like fruit. Once it matures, it is inevitable that it will eventually rot. The economy grows, the private sector stagnates. As elders and bureaucrats become more and more powerful, as time passes, this power becomes the status quo and crushes the seeds of any possible reformation. That is. Such a sad trend. Hmm. I don't really understand all that, but I feel like the situation here is somewhat different. So. Maybe the mono beast killed everyone on the island? What? And that's how it became. I mean. It's certainly possible. That's a possibility, but we don't know that for sure. Hmm. This mystery remains a mystery, it seems. <laughs> it's like everything here is just full of mysteries. Hmm. You're right, it's mysteries on top of mysteries. However, since these mysteries are overlapping with one another, I doubt there's some no-name groupers behind this. What so are you trying to other say? Words... I mean, this situation we're in is undeniably the work of some enormous organization. <laughs> enormous organization? Hmm. Monomi, Monokuma, the Mono Beasts. They're all machines that require major technical skill to operate. Are we screwed? Plus, they need a ton of funding, and there's no way those things are just made for the hell of it. In other words... The organization might be controlling these machines and monitoring the island with those cameras. Then... Could those fiends be hiding on this island? Not possible. Not likely. They're probably running this from somewhere else. Somewhere safe. Oh? Dude, he, he really does act like Byakia. Just, he's fat. <laughs> There's no mistake that an enormous organization is behind all this. Hmm. I see a big organization, huh? I can't imagine what people they could be. In other words... Well, let's see. There's my Togami Corporation, Sonya's Nova Selic Kingdom. In the Kuzuryu clan could definitely be an organization as powerful as one of those groups, if not more so. Huh? Huh? Hm. I'm used to being mistrusted. Do what you will. Hey! I don't care about you or the Kuzuryu clan, but I won't allow you to doubt Miss Sonya. Any theories as to what's going on? Nothing is real. That is my theory. Yes, yes. Just shut up already, loser. Whoa. It's obvious from your flashy clothes that you just want to stand out because you're actually a loser. <laughs> <laughs> it must be hard to make your living in the lame ass loser industry. <laughs> too far, dude. That's going way too far. Hey, Byakia, were you serious just about now? About this being related to your family and Sony as such? Is it interesting? Well, at the very beginning of the game, there's a freaking startup sequence that says, now now starting Danganronpa 2, Goodbye Despair. However. 
And 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 then like also at the beginning, there's some freaking there's some freaking like glitch lines that happen. And then also freaking at, all, at the beginning they walk through a door that they can't oh well that's not really that doesn't really make sense they walk through a door in a black void of space and then they're in the area where they are now the fact that they you know they just appear there So, in other words... What, what what was your theory? What we must do now is find out who our enemy is. If we do that, we'll be much closer to a breakthrough. Luckily, according to the Eham book, we are free to explore this island. Listen. There will definitely be a clue about the enemy on this island somewhere. Let's start looking. I'm gonna do it! <laughs> what are we looking for? Hey! We need listening. We need to find clues that will tell us who our enemy is. Fine. The enemy is Monokuma. The enemy is Junko Inoshima. My theory was parallel universe. <laughs> how? How? Like, how would that work? Byakuya and Nagito was my points for that. I forgot who Nagito was. Who's Nagito? Nagito. Wait, what? Oh, you thought... You thought that Nagito was literally Makoto? I'm guessing. Okay, I can see how you would think that then. Because they share a voice actor. And so does Byakuya. <laughs> and you know, M Makoto was the ultimate lucky student. By four dark they're devas of destruction. They're destined to fall and turn to ash at the might of my four dark divas of destruction. Wow! Hamsters come out of your scarf. <laughs> what? Adorable, you see? Thank you. <laughs> Gundam's my favorite character. Oh my my! Huh? Look at that guy talking to Miss Sony all casually. I'm definitely going to beat the crap out of him later. <laughs> Byakuya is different to himself. If you swap the letters of Nagito Komeda, you get Makoto Naegida. <laughs> Makoto Naegida. M. A. K O T O N A E G I D A. Yeah, you're right. Dude, fingers in his ass. Dude. Fingers in his ass, fingers in his ass. Kanye West he lies, fingers in his ass, fingers in his ass, fingers in his ass. Kanye West he likes big fingers in his ass. Kanye West he likes big fingers in his ass. Kanye West he likes 
put things in his ass. Fingers in his ass. <laughs> he likes in his ass. He likes in his ass. Fingers in his ass. Yes, pinky. And his finger and the thumb in his ass. <laughs> to the butt hole goes numb. West in his ass. North in his ass. East in his ass. Most definitely in his ass. Yes, yes, can't hear what he likes, fingers in his ass. Can't hear what he likes, fingers in his ass. Can't hear what he likes, fingers in his ass. He likes big fingers in his. Can't hear what he likes, fingers in his ass. Can't hear what he likes, fingers in his ass. Can't hear what he likes, fingers in his ass. He likes big fingers in his. Can't hear what he likes, fingers in his ass. That's enough for that. What? <laughs> why? Why is Nagito chosen for that? <laughs> I'm relieved everyone is such high spirits is strange. I can rely on them. This must be what it's like to have confidence of an ultimate. What? What is... Hajime's power or whatever. What is his ultimate? Am I confident enough to call myself one of them? Damn it, I still can't remember. What talents am I supposed to have? Listen. Let me just say this. There's no time to think about something as foolish as killing each other. You must do what you have to do. Observe, speculate, recognize, comprehend, even if it seems impossible, just preserve. Persevere. Can't read. Most importantly, follow my lead. I'll make sure to return to you all to your normal lives. Byaki is gonna die, isn't he? This is your leader's order. <laughs> Ham hands? Hmm. Interesting. Why aren't you Natural. getting mad? Why would you get mad at something as petty as that? She observed me directly. <laughs> Perhaps if I was in for this, no. Maybe. Such silly talk. Seriously, calm. We might just be a reliable person after all. All right. All right, then we should listen to Byakia and not waste our energy thinking about pointless things. It's true that we're not in the best situation, but it's also not the worst. Great. Because we're not alone. Okay, so I'm gonna speculate who lives and who dies, or at least who lives at the end. Okay, so Nagito's gonna live. That's obvious. But who who's gonna live to the very end? Chiaki? Nagito, Nagito's gotta live. Byaki has gotta die though. I honestly have no clue who would die. If Sonya's not a victim, she's gonna live to the very end. Like the on the only character I have full confidence in like living to the end is Nagito. Seriously, that sounds so lame. Aha, uh -huh, I knew it. I was thinking that to myself. Or you know what? Putting putting my theory in the, to to uh, to play. Everyone survives because this isn't real. Friends, huh? Until now, I never really thought about friendship. That sort of thing seemed embarrassing. I never would have thought about that in that situation. No, actually, it's more like because of the situation. In the end, we never solved the mystery of the ominous countdown. But without losing heart, we all went to the hotel. 
Believe in your friends, huh? Be difficult. Blah, 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 blah. There's no reason to hold up in my room and stare blankly into space. Since there's time, it'd be a great idea if we went ahead and talked to everyone. It's time for a brief t t Is this free time? Yeah. The mono mono yashin. When you strengthen a friendship, an intimate event is activated and added to the report card. I'll see you show any hope fragments you've gathered to Usami via the report card and gain new skills. Feel free to strengthen your friendships with as many people as you want. Also, when you spend time with someone, time will pass. It's free time, baby. I have to walk everywhere, so that way my pet... My pet won't poop on the floor. It's me, Hajime. <laughs> the most boring character ever. Yes. I can choose what I want. Jabby and jewelry. Tips and tips. Bajobo dolls. Toy camera, replica sword. Yes. No. Buy potato chips. Also. Huh? Are you serious? I want to talk to Gundam. Where's Gundam? Gundam's at the ranch. Hello. Oh my goodness. I want to go see Gundam. And the cow. And his hamsters. <laughs> Dude, I am like... My nose is tortured. Yes, let's talk to Gun. How pitiful. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes. Let's give him the dolls.
Is this a good idea? You fiend. <laughs> you fiend. Let me ask. Your true name? <laughs> Fine. What? How pitiful. What happened? You fiend. If you flinch, you will die! Good instincts. Do I have to give him a present? Fine. Training, human hunting, craft spell components. Man, my my uh, my sinuses are just tortured. Managing my website takes up the bulk of my time. What? Sorcerers around the world are waiting to see my research results. Of course, my website has been magically enchanted, so the only chosen ones can view it. <laughs> A mere human like you will be. Able to access the dummy site called Exciting Breeding Journal. I'd rather check out the Ultimate Breeders Exciting Breeder Breeding Journal Fine. anyway. I'll make sure to show you well if we ever get out of here. That is, what why is he like in super into magic? What's my favorite food? Fine. You certainly hit the mark. Well, I'm fine of the orange melon, which bears the face of the devil. <laughs> A pumpkin? <laughs> Dude, they're fucking hamsters. I did it. I got a hope fragment. Do I only get one? Still free time. Open map. Form of... I suppose I should. I, sh I should I speak to Teru Teru just because he's fucking weird. Yeah. 
What? Why does he get all this stuff? Titty magazine. Eh? In green so the Super Mario aren't very good. The only stock mass produced could be. When I fresh out the farm, my urban power won't be certified at all. <laughs> You're gonna pay the table with dishes tonight? Ew. No. <laughs> what a ridiculous question. Why would you kill the possibilities of your ingredients by limiting yourself to a specialty? It's Matt. It's Matt Courtney. Yeah, I gotta play it before Chothin does. Understand. Chefs have the right to be called chefs because they create dishes. It'd be simpler, simple for a true chef to create something from nothing. I don't really understand, but he has amazing confidence. Anyway. Anyway, Hajime, I've been wondering this for a while. I'm Hajime. Do you think dishes resemble that a lot? That? Mm -hmm. You know, that. It can only be one thing. Juicy succulent meats intertwined, the naughty sound of squishing and splashing <laughs> ringing each time. The anime. <clears throat> I don't I don't only stream Dang and Ropa, by the way, so you know, watch out for that. Stream a lot of other things. Thanks for coming, Virgil, son of Sparta. Dude. I'm not going to say what his hair looks like, but... I can't stop drooling. Times... It's gentle. At times it's forceful. You gotta drop it. You gotta tease it. You gotta just hammer it in. I hate this character. <laughs> if you ever decide to cook, you should know some simple advice. They say there's a fine line between cooking and screwing. Understand. Well, uh, guess that's geez. about it. Eh? It get me. Uh, <laughs> oh, terror, terror makes my stomach hurt. Terror, terror makes my stomach hurt. Oh. A grief stricken mother and frightened young siblings who were born to different mothers. To stop that crisis, I ventured alone and completed competed in a cooking deathmatch hosted by Shogun of Taste. <laughs> <laughs> Just getting in a dirty cell of hardship like that doesn't suit an attractive urbanite like me. You'd rather hear me talk about my splendid and glorious life as a first-rate chef, right? Hmm, I kinda wanna know more about that cook-off. I am extremely tired. I listened to Terra Terra's bullshit. It's Monokuma. Speak Academy School Trip Executive Committee has an announcement to make. Hello, everyone. The fun time you've all been waiting for is about to begin. I wonder what festivities await you. Oops, don't want to ruin the surprise. It was a little meh at first.
first, but anyway, please gather at Jabberwock Park. What? Did you just tell us to go to the park? It's in the middle of the night. Damn it! Yes, leave. Goodbye. Goodbye, my house. Where are my where are my fellow students? Dude, I have to flush the toilet. <gasps> Dude, I have to keep walking. I want to see what happens to my pet. Dude, what if someone, like, actually ran like this in real life? I shan't go there. Why is Hajime all pixelated? Look, there's the big... Oh, it's scary. <clears throat> Dude, those things are terrifying. Oh, it's like a Pekoyama. Peko Pekoyama. I have no choice. After all, the e handbook clearly states that defying Monokuma is not permitted. However, be foolish to resist if it's just going to make things worse. I hope everything. Anyway. Yep. Let's look at the bomb. Oh, it's a party. Once again, you're late. Did you lose your nerve? I'd like to deny that, but he's not exactly wrong either. That's fine. Anyway, it seems everyone is here. How annoying! Ugh, what is it this time? So friggin' annoying. <laughs> then you shouldn't have come. I mean... Well, I mean, I don't know what'll happen to me if I don't come. <laughs> Since none of us know what'll happen, maybe you should be the one to test it out. <sighs> Hey, you may talk like you're tough, wise guy, but you wouldn't be here unless you were scared, too. Huh? What? Yeah, yeah. I guess even a big bad Yakuza like you must have been scared of that monster, huh? Why, you? What the fuck did you just say? Wait! Stop it, you two fighting among friends isn't good. Huh? What? Did you just say friends? Dumbass! I'm not your friend, dumbass. Why didn't I ever become friends with you bastards? The past. We're all <laughs> mind erased. I can do it, you know. Huh? You. <laughs> do what? Bastard! Don't misunderstand. Jeez. The current rules make more sense to me than that play nice and get along crap. What are you saying? Why, you? Don't Just treat me stop. like a kid, bitch. Just stop already. This kind of fighting will not get us anywhere. Shut the hell up! <laughs> I'm starting to get pumped up! Akane. What's gonna happen if you're this easily provoked? That's enough. Enough. Huh? Enough. Huh? I see. Well, you go. I understand what you're saying. Don't worry. I do not intend to dismiss your feelings. There was a time when I also thought the same way as you. Don't treat me like a fucking kid. Are you treating me like a kid Let too? Let me say this. What would reckless killing accomplish if you fail to get away with it? You know you'll be executed. Or perhaps that's what you really want. If so, hmm. you'd only be killing yourself to run away from this predicament. That's what a child would do. You. 
Listen. Listen, as long as we're here, I will not let any of you die. I will not let any of you become a victim. <laughs> Fat Piaki. It's so funny. That goes for you too, Fujihiko. I won't let you die. <laughs> what the hell? Everything you're saying, it's just empty promises. <laughs> it's true, my words would ring hollow if anyone else spoke about them. My name is Byakuya Togami. And I am destined to bring these promises to fruition. <laughs> Dude, Terra Terra needs to. <laughs> he needs to go. In the name of my family. I will not let any of you become a victim. That is the duty I have appointed my, myself. <laughs> Seems like Byaka resolved it for now. But even if he's the ultimate Yakuza, there's no way to feel. Well, Yuhiko really meant what he said earlier, right? Hmm. Um. What? This is troubling! Tired. I've been reading for like five hours straight. Like you guys were arguing, so I wasn't sure when to actually show up. So I showed up at an awkward time. Hey, hey. Why are you dressed like I missed hey, dialogue? Um... Did I mention it in my recent broadcast? This might cost you for the fun time. Don't well, tell me you're going to. Correct. Two man comedy routine. Uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Of course. Oh, uh. Meaningless. Hmm, <laughs> that figures. Thank you for waiting. Monokuma side splitting live two man comedy. Hey. How pitiful. Let's check it out. Hello! I'm Monokuma! Right clicking laughs. And together we are the Monokumas! Now, I know it's sudden, but I guess I should show you guys my amazing mind reading abilities. Uh, you can read minds? As practice, I'll guess your favorite food. Hmm, your favorite food is. You can do it. It's obvious what rabbits like. Kid. That's right. Davers. I'd never eat a dead body. <laughs> now then, Monami's up next. Come on, do a short skit or something. What? There's no way I can do that. No worries, it's all good. I know a technique to summon the god of comedy. So, which do you think is better? Taking blood while you're still alive, or after you're already dead? Why would you ask such a cruel question? If I'm gonna summon the Comedeity, then I'll need a lot of blood! So, a god of comedy wants blood. Mm, pretty please. No matter how charmingly you ask, there's no way I'll let you take my blood! You're always so quick to make a scary face, Monami. You guys better be careful, too. You know, since Monami's actually a bad guy. What? She's as bad as the first villain the hero fights in a teen manga. They're always the underdog. Believe me, it's a fact that Monami's a villain. I'll let you all in on a little secret of hers. Monami went out of her way to erase your memories! Say what? Wait, huh? You guys don't even remember how you got to this island, am I right? Well, that's because Monami stole your memories! Yeah, that happened last but year, What too. are you saying all of a sudden? But wait, there's more! She didn't just steal your boring memories, like how you guys got to this island. She completely <clears throat> took away your memories of the years you spent at Hope's Peak Academy. What a shocker! Paola! <sighs> I feel great now that I've shared that with you. Seriously, memories.
Very Lost plots are so old hat nowadays. That's literally the whole plot of the last game, so... Only a total hack would wait until the end of the story to reveal a cliché twist <laughs> like that. Please stop! <laughs> Wasn't that a huge surprise? In truth, you guys aren't freshman students at all. You guys just thought you were because you've lost all of your school memories. Quick, someone get a plagiarist because I feel like I've heard this story before. This is literally last game. This is bad in so many ways. I'm through dealing with you. His backhand is far too powerful. Hmm. D that's that's what? Hey, hey! Come on. Huh? <laughs> it's true. Thanks to Monomy stealing your school memories. Are you saying it's impossible? Who knows? Yeah, impossible. yeah, yeah. That's right. At least this happens in chapter one and not chapter five. You can't. Blah 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 blah. Blah 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 blah. Dude, why is she? Does she have rabies or something? I won't believe. I won't believe. <laughs> Wrong. Strange dizziness. Actually, I couldn't think, I couldn't speak, I could only breathe in heavy gasping breaths. I keep forgetting to read out loud. So a, long, a long time has passed since then. Impossible! Impossible, there's no way. Like... On the contrary, why is it impossible? That's... Whether or not it's possible, there's no way we can believe it. They, they do the, it's been two years, so that way they can... Say that they're 18. No, no. You don't. You just don't want to believe it, right? Yeah. <laughs> but don't worry, I'm a generous guy. I can give you back your memories. Uh -huh. Huh? Hey, um. There's a catch. Okay. Don't tell me the catch <laughs> is. Figured it out That's yet? That's right. Yep. Ooh, uh, hey, hey. This. That's this first kill's motive. You want your memories back? Hey, man! You pissed me off. Wah wah? <laughs> their mom. Humans are natural born cowards. They even craft with their mom squeezes them out. Special bleeding service! So I'm giving you a motive. Think of it as an excuse to commit your future crimes. Quiet! Stop this at once. Do you really think your delusional rambling will convince us to commit murder? What are you saying? I don't even believe that memory lost crap in the first place. <laughs> but more than that, what you guys really don't believe is each other, right? What's going on? What do you mean? Hey, um... You guys don't know each other, which means... Yeah None of you realize that a traitor is hiding among you, right? <sighs> hey, why are there 16 of you? A total of 15 students from Hope's Peak Academy were arranged to come to this island. I got it! That's right. There's probably a traitor, and I don't even know about hiding among the group. Just kidding. You. What you're saying is, all this shit about traitors doesn't make any sense. Oh. It's obviously nonsense. Lame! For real, you guys. How can you be so sure? You guys don't know anything about each other. You don't know each other's true natures. <laughs> So if one of you is planning to kill buffed player two 
Dang, this is the most this is the most followers I've gained in like a month. Thanks for following. That's why if one of you is planning to kill someone, it's impossible for any of you to know. With those words, everyone fell silent. I wanted someone to argue with them. Anybody. But nobody said a word. They just stood there. Uh -huh. Even so, if there really is a traitor, isn't that gosh darn awful? Pretending to be your ally and tricking you guys? It makes sense for someone like that to get killed, right? <laughs> come on, make the preemptive strike. It's first come, first serve, and the winner takes all. <laughs> you want to survive, you gotta find that person before they find you. <laughs> I bet it's Chiaki. She can't. She can't be a gamer. Every one of us. The situation, the circumstance, the phenomenon, this disaster, this nightmare, this hell, this despair, consumed every one of us. Um. Um. Is that true? Is it really a traitor among us? You got it wrong. Ah, it's not me, by the way. I know I may look suspicious, but it's not me. Who is it? Hurry up and show yourself. You're only making things worse by staying silent. That's enough. Just stop. There's no way there's a traitor. There's no way. It's pointless to even discuss something so foolish. I won't believe. I if won't it's believe. Right, I won't believe it. Because there's no way I can't believe it. There's no reason in the first place to believe it. Hey. Monami, you would know. <laughs> Classic Monokuma. Yep. Telling children that they have to kill themselves. They're not even children. They're adults. Ten. They use the they use the time skip thing to to make it. You know, them eighteen. Oh. Is what Monokuma said true about our memories loss about the trade? Um. Um. I mean, everyone needs to look to the future. That's why you shouldn't look back to the past. <gasps> Keep your eyes fixed upon the future. Let's do our very best. Huh? Ah, I see she ran away. <laughs> How ridiculous. Memory lost a traitor. It's completely fiction. Dumbass! I can't deal with this bullshit, dumbass. As he said, it's a work of fiction. It's entirely different from the reality I know. Stolen memories, all my school memories, everything. A traitor hiding among us. But what really struck me was when Monokuma said, You guys don't know anything about each other. Ding dong, bing bong. Ahem! Hope Speak Academy School Trip Executive Committee has an announcement to make. It is now 10 p.m. Please return to your rooms and relax. Let the sound of the ocean gently rock you to sleep. Yeah, what the? What's up with the giant now bomb? Then, sweet dreams, everyone. Good night. What should we do? It's better if we call it a night here. We should get some sleep and try to keep our minds calm. Dude, she's a gamer. Look at look at her little gamer hoodie. Oh. This is your leader's order. Just so you know, do nothing but unnecessary things. This is your leader's order. Tomorrow morning, let's meet at the restaurant after Monokuma's morning announcement. Um. How troubling. I think the saying goes, I am frightened so stiff. Huh? I feel pretty stiff right now, too. Uh. That's not how that saying goes, but it's not her fault. She's a foreigner, after all. To be honest, I don't really remember what happened after that, but later I realized something. I was sitting in my bed beside the cottage with my head drooping down on my chest. So I there alone, a strange thought suddenly crossed my mind. Traitor. Could it be someone who isn't like the others? Like someone who doesn't even remember that their talent is? <gasps> what the hell? I don't understand at all. He's the traitor. Hajime is the traitor. Wah wah! Wah wah! 
They say impossible is a word that's only found in a fool's dictionary. Obviously impossible to use a word. It's not in your dictionary. Someone who can actually make things impossible possible. It's all over if you say you that. Can we call that person who doesn't have the impossible? Shut up, Monokuma. Mono bear. Singular bear. Ahem. Hope Speak Academy School Trip Executive Committee has an announcement to make. Good morning, everyone. Looks like today is going to be another perfect tropical day. Now then. Let's show some enthusiasm and make sure to give it Mono our Kuma. all today. Single bear. Both my hand and my body feel heavy, but it's still improvement compared to last night. We all said we'd meet at the restaurant. Where's the freaking bears? <gasps> it's it's Nagito. <sighs> not everyone is strong as Byakia. I've never thought about having to overcome anything before. It's not like I just run away from my problems, but it's more like I was just living my life without even thinking about them all at all. Even so, I was still able to live. But this is different. Sorry. I'm sorry I'm being too negative. No, I understand I'm the same as well. But now that we've talked, I feel reassured once again. Being loners won't get us anywhere. That's why I think we should help each other out. I think we need to get stronger. Or do like this will help us cling to hope. Yeah, you're Bye probably now. right. We gotta be the restaurant now. Bye. I'm squinting so much because I'm tired. By the way. If you're if you're wondering why I'm squinting. Jeez! Jeez, I'm so sleepy. Mr. Hamhands is so selfish. It's totally fine to spend the morning sleeping in. But if you need to eat breakfast anyway, what's wrong with eating it together? Aww. Well, I like to spend my breakfast eating sweets in my room. It's already fine. It's to make too many sugars and fats. Hey! Where's you my doctor? Don't speak to me without permission. Oh, I'm sorry! I'm sorry! <laughs> Jeez, listening to this ugly bitch is crying in the morning makes me so sick. Hydrate. Water. <laughs> oh, now I'm inside of her. Hey. Good morning, Hajime. Yeah, good morning. Aww. Jeez, what's the swollen face? Mm. Well, I guess I might want to talk. I couldn't really sleep last night. Had a lot on my mind. I don't know if I'll ever get the answers I'm looking for. And just for kicks, I should prepare some yummy desserts and tea and invite some people to come chat with Got me. It. Just so you know, it's going to be a girls-only gathering. Don't expect the boys to be invited. Yeah, no silly boys at this gathering. Boys are gross. Boys have cooties. What do girls even talk about? Yeah, yeah. I'll go in ahead. You better hurry to the restaurant. Good morning. Yeah, good morning. <laughs> oh, I just said good morning. Why is she so shocked? <laughs> My first time greeting someone, I was actually greeted back. I'm so happy. I don't trust. I don't trust her one bit. Uh, hello. <laughs> she scares me. Mikan, Mikan scares me. I could go right up there, but I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go see, see Chiaki. Cause he, she's here. Yup, I knew it. Hey. Playing video games. She's a big gamer. 
Well? I'm in the middle of doing combo strings. Oh my god, she's a cat. Yes. What is wrong with her? Good nom nom nomming? Okay. Nobody was talking, not a single word. But they sat there, the people who were late began to arrive as well. I've made you wait. Is everyone here? Huh? It seems Fuyuhiko is not here yet. <laughs> Maybe he already got killed. Bodies already? No. Don't go killing people off. I saw him outside earlier. However, he told me he would not be joining us this morning. Hm. Why does he have to act like a lone wolf at a time like this? Maybe. Maybe he's thinking a plan to kill someone by himself. Ooh. You must not. Kazuichi, you should not doubt your friend. Hey, hey, hey! He's Yakuza, isn't he? Do you understand what that means? He's part of the Japanese Mafia. Hmm. I presume he's the kind of person who would not come even if we summoned him. That's fine. Rejoice. <laughs> That's right. What the? This is your leader's order. Huh? Hmm. Wait, what's so not wrong about? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I'm, I'm eating because I'm hungry. Hmm. Wait. Hey. Clear now. But stop talking. I'm sorry. I see. You know, without Byakia, I mean, Yahoo! we have fat Byakia. We're missing fat Toko. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. I can't stop drooling. 
There's something wrong with you. <laughs> <laughs> I may be a pervert, but I'm the kind of pervert everybody likes. I don't like you. How'd you earn a thousand points that fast? Oh wait, Matt Matt did. Alright, well. He made this happen. about that. All right, I did my pull-ups. Five pull-ups. <laughs> Your confidence is seriously impressive. Please do not, please do not redeem the push-ups right now because I have a blood blister on my toe. And I do not want to, uh, you know, do that. Huh? I'll do the pull-ups though, since that doesn't really involve my feet. You're right. If we were best to clean it, I think it'd be perfect. Plus, it's the only place that meets her needs for an enclosed space, right? However... Indeed, however, Monami has forbidden us from entering the old place. As I recall, it's in the middle of being renovated. Ding, ding, ding. I have heard. I'm a rabbit. I see. Uh? Huh? Hmm. Oh, hydrate too? Oh no, my phone battery's low. My phone battery that I used to look at chat. Cause I don't have a second monitor, Sag. I used to have a second monitor. Hello. <sighs> That's fine. Well, it is of no concern. We can settle that issue another time. Listen. Regarding the old building, you came to tell us something about it, <laughs> right? Yes, if it strengthens everyone's bonds with each other, and I won't hesitate to cooperate. I shall allow it. So in that case, I will allow you to enter the old building and cooperate as you all <laughs> party together. <laughs> together? That's not gonna happen because you're so disgusting. Understand? Do yourself a favor and stay away from mirrors. You'll be grossed out by what you see. <laughs> I'm excited to finally experience it. Hey, hey, hey! There's no way you can call a dirty, our dear princess's hands. Dude, everyone has a crush on Sonya. Aww. Sonya is this game Celeste because she has, you know, a non Japanese name. Sheesh! Hey. Well, I decide by random drawing. Actually. See? Judgment! All right. What? Huh? I'm left with the red mark. <laughs> wow. So does a simp for Sonya. All right. I'll take that as a compliment. Okay. I'll handle the cooking. All right, first I need to prepare my ingredients and I'll start cooking at the old building. There's no mistaking it. All right, Terry Terry Hanamura will go, oh, I will prepare the world's tastiest dishes for you all. Then. 
I need to pass along the party details to Fuyuhiko. Hmm. Let's go about our business then. After Monokuma's nightly announcement, we'll meet at the old building. After everyone left, I decided to go back to the cottage. There's still some time before the party. There's no way I can spend it staring into space in my room. This is some free time. Better talk to talk to people. All right, who should I talk to? And where should I go? <gasps> my little buddy. My little buddy. Oh. Oh my god. 97 steps. I do not want to talk to Mikan. Actually, tell me who I should tell tell me who I should hang out with actually. Chiaki? Is there a hidden Monokuma in here? I'm actually looking for the Monokumas. Oh, there it is. No, that's not a Monokuma. Where's the Monokuma? Where is it? Maybe Ibuki or Akane. All right, I'm gonna look for some Monokumas first though. Let me look for Monokuma. Mono Mono Yashin. Not right now. Where are the Monokumas? That's what I'm looking for. I guess I'll <laughs> hang out with Ibuki. When it comes to this party, Stylish BGM is a must That's have. Totally it. Maybe to Ibuki, I'll pump up the volume with a live performance. What should I do? Hang out with Ibuki? Yes. I got it! Potato chips. Bo -bo Bojobo dolls. Hajime. Meow. Oh my God, she's she's literally one of those. She's she's the te penguin of doom. School clubs. Wasn't any clubs. <laughs> That's a major boingo. Uh, you should be part of Ibuki's music club from now on. For a while, everyone thought music clubs were outdated because the rock and roll boom was dying off. That's totally it. Now music clubs are super popular with boys for some reason. 
Just jump on the bandwagon too. Not really an issue. <laughs> you no problem. You can just pretend you're playing an instrument while a music track plays in the background. That's something. That's not something the ultimate musicians would say. What do I have to do if I don't really feel the love? It's okay, jamming Ooh. out is so much fun. It'll be probably with the latest chicks go out with guys who pretend to be musicians Hi, all the Jimmy. time. By the way, Buki thinks guys who don't like bands are narcissists, so she doesn't like them. Isn't something else? Blah, 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 blah. Guitar! Um, bass. Aww. Wow. Drums. Good job. <laughs> Every drummer in the world would hate you for saying that. I see. I see. Now we've decided on an instrument. Uh -huh. Let's start with learning how to use the loudspeaker. Huh? What? It's a must-have item for live performances. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't mean you just hold it and scream into it. <laughs> oh my god. Maybe I should go for a walk. Let's fast travel to the supermarket. Where are the freaking monokumas? I gotta find the monokumas. There's a monokuma. I knew you could do it. Are there more? Oh, Monokuma! Come here, Monokuma. How many Monokumas are in the game? I I want to hang out with. Fat Biakia. Honestly. <laughs> I shall enjoy Terra Terra's dishes as well. What should I do? Invite Biakia to hang out? Yes. Hmm. By my company's personal chef. Okay. I was forced to listen to Biakia speak at the length about the various dishes he's eaten. Looks like Biaki let me get a little closer to him. Yes. I'm gonna give him some some dang potato chips. Hmm. Interesting. You have quite a rare item there. Even a noble such as myself has never touched something like this. <laughs> Shut up. I gave him the potato chips. Listen. So let me ask you, what is your body fat percentage? Little baby darling. I don't know the exact number. I've never had to check what? before. What? This can't be.
<laughs> I swear this is why I dislike commoners, little darling. Dude, Fat Biakia is definitely someone who calls his, you know, his little princess. Uh, Jay, why are you in my channel? I thought you hated me. And no, I don't. I don't know what that means. I mean, you. what's with everyone, like, Twitter? Fuck is up with everyone on my Twitter. I see. There's not there's literally nothing wrong with my Twitter. You're a nine. No, maybe an eight. Hmm. Regardless, it's probably around one digit. <laughs> Be grateful this is a tropical island. You're somewhere less hospitable. You'd freeze to death. We all miss him. Anyway, you still can't remember what your talent is, so I'm only here because I need something in full on it. It's so rude, Jay. If anything, my fucking Twitter is a bastion of hosp hospitality. I don't cancel anyone. I make fun of people, but you know. Yeah, don't not worry. yet. I see, however. There is no need for you to be depressed about it. Yeah, Twitter sucks. You should follow my Twitter at https colon slash slash www.twitter.com. Uh, is there like, is there like a, a link but or use your Twitter handle. HTTPS colon slash slash w. What? When did I drop 23,000 frames? When did this happen? <laughs> what? I just looked at OBS for the first time in like an hour. When did I drop 23,000 frames? It's just twitter.com slash lokibo underscore. I lost two followers? What? Come on. What's with that face? A darling. Oh, one of them got probably banned off Twitter. The other one is, you know, I got canceled again. Hmm. How foolish. Do you really think I'd get mad about something like that? I didn't even read what, like, what we're talking about. There is no need for you to be oppressed about it. Oh, <laughs> yeah, this Biaki is much nicer than the other one. <laughs> In the name of my family. <laughs> this is not the real Byakuya Togami. Listen. Hmm. Goodbye. Dude. 
I got another hope fragment. Uh, so you get two per free time, pretty much. Ahem! Hope Speak Academy School Trip Executive Committee has an announcement to make. Why did I drop so many frames? It is now 10 p.m. Oh my goodness. Please return to your rooms and relax. Let the sound of the ocean gently rock you to sleep. Now then, sweet dreams, everyone. When is the first murder? When is the first murder? Look at the booty. Oh my my! Are you here for the party? What else would I be here? What else are you doing at a place like this? <laughs> I'm doing a little exercise so you can enjoy all the yummy food we're gonna eat. I'm excited to eat Terra Terra's cooking, yeah, especially since he's the ultimate cook. I just saw... Ooh. Fading into existence. Look how short I am! How'd you make it short too? What girls, girlies. I let Fuyuhiko know about the party, but he didn't look too pleased about it. <laughs> it's about time for the party, Hiki. I'm really excited. Oh. I'll do my best not to be in the way, so it's fine if I stay here, right? You're really worried about something like that? Oh. Yes! Is there anyone inside? Is it is Chihiro in here? I mean, Chihiko? Ch I forgot her name. <laughs> So this is the old building compared to the hotel. It definitely looks worse for the wear. Hmm. You're here. Now then, let's stand up straight and raise your arms. Why do I have to do hmm. that? Because I need to do a body check. Body check? So I'm the one hosting the party. It's necessary for me to take all possible security measures. Listen. I already promised I would not allow one person to become a victim. I get it. So I reluctantly raised my arms and stood up straight. Bianca went ahead and thoroughly searched me. So he was legs and working his way up. I oh, see. Bianca. It proves you haven't brought anything dangerous. That's fine. Metal what? cases? Duralamin. Actually, I found them at the supermarket. This one is used to store any dangerous items I found by, during body checks. The only is for, let's just say it's for emergencies only. Stop talking. Is it big enough to stuff a body in? Where are the cases? Jump. Jump. I'm, I'm like trying to jump. But there is no jump. Here he is, guy. Let's go into the toilet. Oh? There's a tantalizing aroma watching from the kitchen. Sheesh! Yeah, will you let me if I was straight to the dining hall? You should have her there as well. Shut up, I don't care. Mm. There's a monitor in here too. This me on the bone looks like something a caveman would eat. Where would you even get something like this? I'm hungry, I guess you should go to the dining hall. Knife set. It's a knife set near there. Just so many different types of knives. I don't know anything about knives, but Terry Terry probably knows how 
It's not if it's useful. More importantly, I should have over to the dining hall for now. This is the kitchen's equipment list. Hello there. Did you need something? The way I've repaired all this. Do you want me to cook you up too? What does that even mean? <laughs> yes, leave. Uh, why are these both? Um, Sonia, what are you doing here? I see. I see. So this is what the inside looks like. There's so many gaps in the wooden forest because it's so old. Oh! I must be I must strike carefully so my feet do not stumble. My adventurous heart is pounding with excitement. I guess when your friends to see even little things seem exciting. I drop more frames. This is infuriating. Stacked boxes, darling? These are irons. Were they used to prepare the tablecloth? So, what do you need here? What do you need three? Shove the dining hall. This is a laundry hamper. It looks like you can put dirty clothes in here. I should over to the dining hall. I don't like how Desi is in here. There's a jumble mass of stuff all stacked together. It doesn't look organized. Oh, I didn't check out my pet. Oh my god, it's a snake. This present is too valuable to give away. Um, wow. I want to give my little baby darling a present. Snake. I need to lie flat on the floor. <laughs> ah, how'd you mean? How do you like it? What do you mean? See, I decorated the whole dining hall for the party. Why are the walls bolted up like the old game? There's nowhere to escape to. You're on an island. Yep. <sighs> Thanks. Iron plates? That reminds me, I was listening to one of why are there iron plates bolted onto the walls? How pitiful. Oh, it's not what it appears to be. Bruh, it's Monaco. I don't think, I mean it is, but it isn't. It's not, this is suspicious. Stay back. One of my four divas, Supernova Silver Fox Sandy. Has seen what lies shrouded amidst the darkness. Although that iron plate appears to be bolted to the wall, it's actually bolted over what's known as a window. Let me tell you this. There are no windows in this dining hall at all. I assume my iron plates are covering them. Why are iron plates covering the windows? The night is my domain. Hmm. Sandy, it appears your fur is rustling more than usual today. Little baby darling. Let's make history. This 
place has a creepy atmosphere because of that. This whole place sure is run down. I feel bad Nagito went to all this trouble cleaning it. Even cleaning has its limits. See, so check out the floorboards. Maybe the wood shrank because of deterioration? Don't these openings seem dangerous to you? You're right. Aww. Well, the carpet is spread out enough. Increasing verbose. What? Hey. But it might be de best to tell Mikan to be careful. She is the type to trip over nothing. Gross! That creep Byaki rubbed his ham hands all over me and called it a body check. A lot of nasty looking dishes here. Oh man, she's horny for food. <laughs> ah. That was uncomfortable. Getting groped so thoroughly by a man, that was my worst nightmare. How annoying! Man. Aw, oh, man. I've made you wait. Thank you for waiting. So how does the skill system in this... I don't know. This is, I, I've only played <laughs> the freaking... I haven't played the actual game. I'm like six hours in. And I haven't played the actual game yet. And I'm not going to get to tonight either, because I'm going to stop playing after I do the investigation. Jeez. I explicitly stated that attendance was mandatory, but it's fine just if just one person is absent. That shouldn't pose a problem. He won't be able to do anything. Mm -hmm. What do you mean what? by that? More importantly, hmm? come on. What is that? An intense expression spread across Bianca's face as he looked at the table. Not possible. Dangerous. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? I'm <laughs> testing the food for poison. You're the food. No fair. No, I'm not. I don't care what you say. You're totally pigging out. <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm not... Look carefully at this dish. It looks like delicious roasted meat! And just what is stabbed into this roasted meat? Hmm? It's an iron skewer. That's right. This iron skewer is definitely a dangerous item. I must take full responsibility and collect it. <laughs> okay. Hello there. Some messy eater ruined my arrangement. Hmm. Who made this dish? Um, That'd be me, but um, are you a food critic? What are you thinking? What are you plotting? Cooking with such dangerous no, items. No, 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 no. Dangerous? That's churrasco, a South American meal where you stab meat with an iron skewer to cook it. Mm -hmm. It felt really tropical and exotic, so I thought it would totally fit in this party's atmosphere. <laughs> These iron skewers are a problem. Why? Iron skewers aren't allowed either? <laughs> That's how you're acting. That's how you're acting. There might be more skewers than just these. Let's go. <laughs> Dude, every time he stomps off, it's so funny. Man. It's your fault for standing right in front of him. My condolences. Byaki's face poured an intense expression as a real Hilly followed him out of the dining room. Let's go. All right, this is the kitchen. We have to thoroughly inspect it to make sure there are no dangerous items. Mm 
knives, pans, pots. Listen. Champagne glasses are gonna be used to make knives. The champagne bottle can be used to make a weapon. Hmm. Naturally. The giant caveman meat. I see. What? I see. Very strange. One of the items just seems to be short by one. What would that be? I can't count all those wine glasses. Okay. Hmm. Very sh Don't make me repeat myself. I'm doing this because it's necessary. What? Hmm. It's not that I've been to show for the final memory. Mm hmm. Yep, that's 20. What's missing? Hmm. I cannot talk to others about my past. I suspect that my skeptical nature is partly to blame. Hmm. Distrusting others and being distrusted in return. For a long time, my life has been a living hell. It's because you're not really Byakia. <laughs> but in this kind of situation, my skeptical nature might be of good use. For to survive here, skepticism is necessary at all costs. By the way, that pass you mentioned, That's enough. now is not the time. However, one day there will definitely be a time when I will be able to maybe tell you hmm. about it. If nothing happens, the time passes for us peacefully. We have no choice but to talk. That sounded pretty deep. I sort of feel like... These are more... Such silly talk. And up with the unnecessary banter, we better hurry and find the rest of those dangerous items. Yeah, I got it. Even though he sure works as hard. It's probably more than Lamb of the Sex. Huh? Huh? Stop talking. Hmm. Huh? Don't make me repeat myself. You could scoop out an eyeball with a spoon. You're kidding, right? No, 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 no. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> I'm the one who's depressed here. <laughs> hey, before you start getting all flirty, explain this. I checked the equipment list and there seems to be one iron skewer missing. Mm -hmm. Ah, that's right. As far as I know, that's been missing from the start. Mm. This has been missing all along. We can't really do anything about it, right? <laughs> You're right, there's no place to hide such a long skewer anyway. Very well, I need to just keep a watchful eye. 
Don't tell me you plan to keep a watch for well, all Let's go. Well, Alright, let's go back. The others should be waiting for us. You too, Terra Terra. Come to the dining hall for ah. now. <laughs> He's pushy. Ah. ah, they're finally back. Hey, hey. Hey, let's eat already. I'm starving. Hmm. Still an issue we need to regress for. Lies. All right. That's enough. That won't be necessary. The issue is where to safeguard this Duralumin case that has all the confiscated dangerous items. Hmm. I've already put a lock on the case, so it shouldn't be a problem, but we should definitely put up the security and keep it in someplace safe. Uh, I see. The storage room, huh? Even so we can't leave the case alone then... in there. I'll do it, of course, says Peko Peko Yama. Uh, <laughs> Aww. I don't mind. Does she carry that sword around with her all the time? <laughs> However, Uh oh. Man. Okay. Yeah, that's totally fun. What? It might be better if you avoid the storage room. It's hard to see in there. Full cobwebs. <laughs> I was busy cleaning the dining hall and the main storage room. Sit in there for a long time, I think it'd be bad for your health. I see. Yep. Understood. I need to be on guard duty at the office. Then she be going have fun tonight, everyone. Taking her in with her the Duralami case and the plate pot with food. Pekka left the dining hall. I see, I see. Pekka's back as she walks away makes me feel like she's got this super cool melancholy vibe. Huh? Hmm. This? No, this case is fine. That's weird. Naturally. When you're as special as me, you get special privileges. <laughs> when you put it that way, it's hard to argue with you. Listen. This Duralumin case stays with me at all times. I put the key to the case in here as well. I take full responsibility for watching over it. There's no way I can let anyone else handle this matter. <gasps> Stop talking. Is Byakuya the first? I'm gonna do victim? it. Hmm. <clears throat> That's right. Monokuma, of course, he's the only thing that could obviously disrupt this party. I'll show you my serious side. Hold on. If you actually pick a fight with that thing, you're gonna end up perforated. Move! You tell me to wait till I starve to death? Hey! Starve to death? That's a little extreme. Hmm. Our opponent is not someone we can just fight. Rather, it's better we just use our heads and think of a plan. Hey, hey! I'll do something about it. What? Do something, hey, you? Hey! Hey, now what can a girl like you do? We're just gonna put yourself in jainer. Nope. I won't. It's not like I'll personally do something. You won't? <laughs> Do you intend to utilize Monomi? Yep. Yeah, if I can talk to her, talk her into helping us, she might be able to keep Monokuma at bay. At least that's what I think. Uh, that's probably a good idea. She looks like the type that's easily manipulated. Oh! The more I talk, the more stuff my nose gets. Akane is super hungry. Like me, I am pretty hungry. Plus, Monomi and Monokuma have a rivalry going on. 
It's a pretty one-sided rivalry. Are you okay? Will you really be okay, Chiaki? I think it's dangerous. It's gonna be fine. It'll be fine if things are dangerous. I'll just run away as fast as I can. Well, then I'll be going now. What is this feeling? I feel somewhat uneasy. So I have a bit feeling about this, but something feels off. <sighs> so it's all settled, right? Then can we... <laughs> You're right. Let's begin. <laughs> <laughs> so the banquet has finally commenced. <laughs> <laughs> and with that, the party started. Now to think about it, I still don't understand why we're even having a party in the first place. Whatever the reason, everyone seems to be having fun. Hey, are we good? Can I finally eat? You're already eating! <laughs> I, I can't stop. <laughs> I can't stop my hands from shoving food in my face. Well, of course you can't stop. These are the world's tastiest party dishes, after all. I want a hamburger. No matter how full you feel, you can't help but continue eating such exquisite delicacies. That is what I cook, the world's tastiest dishes. <laughs> That's rather scary. You're not eating? Well, then I'm gonna eat all this by myself. Come. I'll make lots more in the kitchen, and then I'll bring it all out here, okay? Hey, everyone. While we're at it, why don't I take pictures for you guys? Wow. That sounds wonderful. Please do. This feels weird. When I first came to this island, watching everyone have fun was so frustrating, but now it feels reassuring. We're actually friends who fight together, friends who develop a sense of unity. <laughs> Hydrate. Mm. Delicious. Negamara, did something happen? The party's just started, but I must return to my cottage. Come on. Don't be foolish. I won't allow such Don't selfish actions. Me. Don't stop me, Byakya. Here comes a time when a man knows when he's gotta go. If I don't go now, it would shame me as a man. Sure. Shitting my pants would totally shame me as a man. What? What? The door won't open. Eating any percent speed run. I am hungry for dinner. <laughs> Impossible. I've been playing this for so long. It's six o'clock already. I started streaming at eleven, pretty much. I'm gonna shit. <laughs> oh shit, I'm gonna shit. See, this is this is the screen cap. Quiet. Don't you dare. Hey, is it really alright if we get all this? What did you say? Her personality is just eating. Like, she's not even the ultimate gymnast, she's the ultimate eater. Come on! Hey, Byakuya, everyone, come on. I'm gonna take a picture. Say cheese! Say cheese! <laughs> Why can't you all act a little more mature? What? What was that sound just now? Bazap. It's dark all of a sudden. <gasps> it's a blackout. Uh oh. Hey, I can't see anything. It's pitch black. My 
my future is pitch black! Is that a conning? The sounds of screams and frantic footsteps ring through the dark dining hall. And we're immediately swallowed up by another sound. Everyone, calm down! We gotta stay calm in a situation like this! Is this Sonia? Sonia, never mind? That's, uh, he, he, I forgot her name, Hiyoko. What the hell? What's going on here? Is that Byakia? Because the windows were entirely covered, the blackout surrounded us with complete darkness. Complete darkness, therefore no matter how long I wait, there's no way my eyes will adjust. This is... Ow! Turn the damn lights on! I can't eat like this, you know! That's a kind of guys... Where are you? Wasn't the blackout just in the kitchen? That's Terry Terry. Perhaps the breaker overloaded? Hold on a sec. I'll go along the wall and do something about it. Within the darkness, we fervently waited to be released from our fear. We anxiously waited, and after a while, it finally... Ah, my eyes. Zap. Ah! At the moment the lights in the dining hall finally turned back on, a shocking scene unfolded before our eyes. <gasps> that is... Oh my god. Uh, I'm sorry! I tripped again! Why? <laughs> Seriously? How do you trip and land like that? Yay! An erotic pose! That's obviously a fan service moment! Hiyoko. Yeah, please don't look at the screen. I can't take this at all! Myro, it's time to snatch some shots! <laughs> there, there's no way I can do that. <laughs> please forgive me. Just forgive me already! Everyone, I think it would be best if we help her already. Just close your legs. <laughs> From now on, just be careful. Huh? I'm glad the lights are back on in Yay! here, too. Hey! Well, I couldn't find my way back to the office with the circuit breaker. Huh? Why are the lights back on? <laughs> who knows? What? Are you stupid? Don't who knows me. You're so useless. <laughs> it's not my fault, you know? There's no way I could have found my way to the office in the darkness. Oh, my. What happened? Sonia, did something happen? Byakuya is missing. Did he go somewhere? Huh? Eh? Byakuya? Now where to be found? Huh? That's weird. He was here earlier, right? Um. Did he run off somewhere during the blackout? In that pitch blackness? Hey. I'm a little worried. We should split up and go look for him. I'll look in the storage room. So can I ask you to check the entrance? For now. Then. Oh wait, here's some kind of in the middle of eating anyway. I must bathe. Sure. Jeez. If I find him, I'm gonna finger flag me in the face as a punishment. Give it over to Byakuya Gold. Um. I searched the hallway, but there's no sign of Byakuya. Where did he go? Is he outside? Here's Chiaki. Monomi. Hajime, what about the party? Oh. How well, wow, it's not done yet, right? I haven't even joined in yet. Chiaki, did you happen to see Byakia pass by here? Nope. Byakia, nope, I didn't. But what happened to Byakia? There was a sudden blackout inside the old building, and Byakia vanished during that time. So we thought he might have gone outside, but nope, nobody came out. 
Nobody came out. Does that mean he's still inside? If that's the case, we might have missed each other. I think. That's what I think. Hey. Ah, Hajime, how'd it go? When I talked to Chiaki, she said she didn't go outside. That's... No one was this, this room dream either. Hmm. He was in the kitchen, obviously. Hmm. No one was in the office. It is strange, no? Nobody was in the office? That's weird. What about Pekko? I thought she was supposed to be going in that area. Hey. Actually, not even Pekko was in there. Huh? Pekko's gone too? Hmm. Maybe those two took advantage of the blackout to have themselves a major makeout session in the bathroom. Well done. I don't want to snort. This mucus. Hmm. Hmm. That's a new sprite. Um. Something happened to Connie? It smells. Do any of you smell something? Well. When partially digested food is absorbed, the small intestine is decomposed by bacteria releasing gas, which is mostly absorbed in the intestinal tract. But whatever cannot be absorbed is excreted from the anus. Yes. Those are the mechanics of farting, but farting isn't something to be embarrassed about. It's not like that. Wait. It smells like blood. Blood? Blood. Hmm. Blood. Kanae's nose switched like a beast's. She suddenly pointed. <sighs> it's coming from over there. Uh-oh, here it comes. Smell of blood. Blood. It's under there. Under the table? Why am I nervous? Do it. Do it. Ah! Do that noise. I knew it. Fat Bianca. Fat Byakuya! For the rest of my life, I will never forget what I saw. Fat Byakuya! <laughs> Dead under the table. I knew it! I knew he was going to be the first victim. Biako, yeah, Biako, yeah. Why is Biako here? Yeah? No. No. Is the gaze quality the body of my former friend? Why? Why? What is this? Hey, 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 hey! This is impossible. Are you kidding me? Don't mess with me. This must be some kind of mistake. Eh? This can't be real blood, right? It's gotta be something like jam or sauce. Because if not, run, this... Run, 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 run. There she goes, rabid face again. What the hell? Ugh. Yeah! Now finally, Monokuma is finally Thrills, chills, kills. interested, interesting, interested. Murder? Could it be? Then does this mean? <laughs> That's right. Biakia was killed by one of you. Wah? Of course! If you look at the body, you can tell instantly he was obviously murdered. <laughs> look, he has such a horrible expression on his face, don't you think? A face full of regret that his life was ended by force. All thanks to someone else's selfish desires. To have a dying face such as this. If this is a murder, then what the heck could it be? Suicide? Hmm. 
Byakia was most likely sacrificed by someone who really wanted to leave this island. Lies. It's all lies. You're saying you're lying that he was murdered. Murdered. The moment that I screamed that word. A thick, muddy feeling of despair swelled within my body. Which means that. But I've accepted the fate. The fact that Bianchi was murdered. What is this? I know, what is it? Could it be? Is that really Biakia? Why? How did this happen? Why Biakia? Phew! Fuyuhiko. What are you gonna do? Yay, death announcement. A body has been discovered! Yay, body discovered! Now then, after a certain amount of time has passed, the class trial will begin! Hey, um... One of you gets murdered, the rest of you have to debate who you think is the blackened. Correct! That's impossible! It can't be. Someone actually killed, there's no way. <laughs> if you make up an outburst like that, you'll end up being a suspect. That's... I won't believe it. One of us killed Kakia. There's no way something as hopeless as that would have ever happened. No, no, no! If you're actually thinking that way, it means you guys are already being conned by the killer. <laughs> come on, come on, let's hurry up and begin. An impassioned, life risking battle between you guys and the Black. And it's already started. So the moment one of you plotted to kill someone. Hey! Hey, what are you saying? You can't! Everyone, please, you cannot, you should not. <laughs> Which is only one truth. On my grandfather's. You're not gonna finish that line. Huh? You have a grandpa. On my grandfather's. On your grandfather's what? Me. On my grandfather's. Okay. Emergency. This is kind of depressing. You ain't my comedy partner anymore. Ah! It hurts so much when you hit me with a charging corkscrew attack. <laughs> Did you see that? The stunning display of power to fire your big brother and I will show you no mercy. I will harden my heart and teach you a lesson you will not soon forget. <laughs> if only I had my magic stick. Fine, fine. <sighs> Yahoo! Investigating, huh? What is this? What does this mean? I don't understand this at all. I searched for Byakia's killer. Why did it turn out like this? What's going on? Uh, give me a break. Why do I have to be involved in this horrible situation? Um, um you can't doubt each other because you're all friends. Understand? Mr. Ham Hands really did get killed, right? If we don't find out who the killer is, we're going to get killed, right? Please wait. That being said, I cannot abide by this. Now that I finally made friends, there's no way I can doubt them. So... Seriously? Did you even listen to what I said? It doesn't matter if you can abide by this or not. You gotta do this to survive, right? Then we have no choice but to do I it. I won't forgive you! Friends, daddy... Mm-mm. <clears throat> Shut up! Shut up! Oh, uh... But... No! However... However... 
It's just as Hiyoko said, if we're gonna get killed for not doing it, then we must do it. But still, I can't believe one of us killed Byakia. There's no way I can believe it. There's no way. For that reason, yep. I'll do it. I'll investigate Byakia's death. I'll do my best to prove there's no killer among us. It's Makoto. Is there any deceiver doubt each other? We need to not fire. There's no mistake. But what's trying to crush us? This despair. So. This hopeless reality is the real enemy we need to fight. If I'm gonna survive this, then I have to fight it. Um. Before you start, can I say something? Well? No. A closed circle detective games. The player usually has to decide on who's gonna guard the crime scene. What should we do? I know. Oh yeah, it would be bad if the killer destroyed the evidence and got away with it. <laughs> Destroyed the evidence. Pointing. Look over there, the big bulky brawny guy is perfect for the guard job. <laughs> what the heck? What happened? Man. That guy has a sensitive heart despite his looks. Is that what that means? Hey. Um, I can be the one who watches the crime scene. I don't have enough confidence to investigate the body. It's not like I have the brains either. I'll just stay by Byakuya's side. That's the least I can do. That's what guard duty is, right? Just take pictures of it. I'll do my best. Yes. I have medical training, so if it's not too much trouble, I can perform an autopsy, please. Um. You're gonna stay as well. Is that okay? <laughs> and what specifically should we be doing now? I have no idea. Hmm. It's pretty obvious. We're all just amateurs. Going through each grain of sand on the beach just to find a clue would be a waste of time. The only ones who can do that are the police. There's no way amateurs like us will be able to do that. Hey. So let's first roll out our intuition. We'll start from there and prove that none of us could have killed Bayakia. <laughs> but to perform an autopsy on your friend, how cruel. <laughs> I won't believe. I won't believe. Ah. Uh, <laughs> Fine, I'm in. You are right. If we're able to survive, this is our only path. This is the worst. Something like this is the only thing we can do in order to stay alive. I gotta do it. It's investigate time. <laughs> You thought it was time for the investigation, but... It's the Monokuma file! Oh my god, Monokuma file. Hey! Hey! What the hell's a Monokuma file? I don't file? like this! Explaining the rules of time really breaks my bones. Who are you? It's not like I have the bones in the first place. Like, don't even make such lame jokes. I'm gonna save. Allow me to explain. The Monokuma file contains precise and detailed information regarding the Dval Bomb. What? Brought it to you so you guys can smoothly proceed with the investigation. I'm such a nice Sing. guy. I'm so nice. I want to be known as the Mother Teresa of the mascot world. Hey, hey. Nice, you see. You're just a selfish meanie. What's this? My, my. Monomi, the mean this mascot, you're still here? Don't put me in the meanest mascot genre. Damn it! <laughs> Byaki Togami. The victim's body was discovered in the dining hall of the old building near the Hotel Mirai. Estimated time of death is 11.30 p.m. 
The victim was repeatedly stabbed over 10 times between the throat and abdominal region, resulting in death. Aside from that, the body has no other external injuries. No chemicals such as poison were detected. Biakia really is dead. Damn it, you promised there wouldn't be any, even be one victim. Why'd you end up being one? And now I'll never know what you're going to say to me. I cannot talk to others about my past. I suspect that my skeptical nature is partly to blame. This is to make up for Byakia not dying in the first game. In the end, what did it even mean? Could it be? So if there really is a treasure, isn't it gosh darn awful? Is anybody your ally checking you guys? Can we help me? A traitor? No way, just because he said a lot of serious things it doesn't mean that he was a traitor. What am I thinking? Monokuma file number one. It's been added to your handbook. Careful you examine everything. If I were to this, yes. Truth bullet. Smonokuma file number one. The victim's body was discovered in the dining hall in the old room. Okay. Let's invite. Let's investigate the duralamin. Ah, uh, this is the metal case Bianca had with him. I believe he said it was made of duralamin. Last time I saw it was closed, but. A lot of odd things inside this case, like a nightstick and pepper spray. What's this? A hard plastic case, but it's just a case. The inside is empty. I wonder what was inside. But the one thing that really catches my attention is a small key. It must be the key to the other Duralamin case. That other case was in the office, and all these likely dangerous items were inside of it. The key to that Duralamin case is right here, then it's unlikely that the murder weapon used to kill Biago was checking that case. Which means the weapons are the ground in case aren't related to Byakuya's murder. Truth bullet. Why did Byakuya have this ground case in the first place? Duralamin case has been added to truth bullets. It's investigation time. Yeah. Oh hell, handy ring. Answer my call. Impossible! This effort is futile as well? Are you still looking for the earring you dropped? You! It's not a mere earring, it is the Hellhound earring. Fine. Long ago in a faraway land, a beast known as the Hellhound was feared by all, even by he who summoned it. The Hellhound tore its way through innumerable battlefields, its fangs listening with blood and its strange Blood red fur would dry in the howling winds of loneliness. When I finally tamed that diabolic beast, I received an earring to commemorate that event. Shiver! A hellhound earring. So that I may never forget the night that I battled with fearsome Pomeranian. I wear that earring at all times. I understand it's important to you, but for now we need to invest. I won't let you! Maybe it fell underneath the floor? The carpet didn't cover the whole floor. It might have fallen through the gaps, the gaps between the exposed floorboards. Ha <laughs> <laughs> That's what inspired such a clever little bobble. I can see it! There it is. I found it. Truly, the hellhound earring. Let me ask. How do I recover it? Can I fit my arm to be opening? Or do I use a tool? It'll probably not reach it either. What? You! The world will come to an end if the human race were to lose that earring. If you flinch, you will die! Fine. Ok, 
caps in floorboard. A lot of fancy looking party dishes in the end, nobody really ate that much, but I can't manage these related incident. Another message of the ordinary. My hero Koizumi. Are you alright? Yeah, I'm fine. What's going on? Is that what you expected me to say? Because I feel terrible. I'm going to be back as alive and well, and then there's something awful suddenly happens. Of course I'm not Why? fine. And not only that, whoever killed him is one of us, right? That hasn't been determined yet. It already has been determined. You've already accepted it, haven't you? This is the worst. We just find out who killer is. Find out which friend killed our friend. I don't like it either, but we won't survive if we don't go through with it. It's not just for yourself, we have to do it to protect all of us. If only I had acted calmer during the blackout, Byaki might still be alive. This is the worst. The whole thing would have never happened. Gundam being over dramatic. I think he's being the perfect amount of dramatic. Jeez. Getting cheered up by a boy isn't like me at all. Got it. Shit, my arms are rushing up. Hey, how'd you forget what I just said? Got it? Yeah, that's fine, I got it. Hmm. Don't do it for now. I can't make it boom 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 boom. But there might be a clue that only I have access to. Hey! Photos. The ones that took just before the blackout, remember? Hey Byakia, everyone come on, I'm gonna take a picture. Say cheese. Hmm. Wanna see them? I have a digital camera so I can show you them to you right now. This one. Partying in this room is so depressing. Huh? Hmm. Byakia was sitting in a totally different place from where he found him. Wasn't his body under the table with the lamp on top of it, the one underneath the monitor? Prior to that, Byaku was standing along the wall farthest away from that table. Right, that's pretty far. That's something. Everyone's standing position for the blackout might be a huge clue. Hey, can you approximate everyone's standing position from these photos? I was thinking the same thing. It'd be hard to understand from the photos alone. It might be better for me to plot it out. But would that actually provide a clue? I don't know yet, but I feel like it could. Leave it to me. Got it. Leave it to me. It's pretty much the only job I can do anyway. Thank you. You better do your best. Do you understand? How did Byakuya die? Another follow. Oh my god. Oh my god. Why is my mouse? Oh. Who followed? My name is Celestia Ludenberg. All these dang and Rompa fans. So, just from here, it looked like he was trying to go underneath the freaking table. He was he was murdered underneath the table, because there's no blood around the table on top of the tablecloth. It's all underneath. Hey, hey, Hajime, there's something I want to run by you. Before the blackout occurred, Byaki was in the dining hall with the rest of us, right? Yeah, that's right. Mm -hmm. And if Byaki's dead body was discovered after the blackout, then don't you think he died during the blackout? Well, now that you mention what? it, but why is Byaki's body under a table? Also, there wasn't a sound of a struggle. So, was his throat stabbed first? If the killer tried to hide him, it's not like he would have stayed hidden forever. It's true. Which is why I think he was killed while under the table. Because, you know, again, not even investigating it. All the bloodstains are underneath, underneath the fucking thing. Isn't it confusing? 
You're absolutely right. It seems finding out what was exactly happening in the black house here to a little bit. There's no way I'd know. It was so dark during the blackout, I didn't see a thing. That's not it. All I've seen was possible. It was impossible, and there's a possibility someone might have heard something. What are you talking about, her? Oh, Akane. I must be missing it. Does she? Aww. I need to calm down first. Okay, I I drink my water. Yes. Okay, as this is it's pretty obvious from how you felt earlier. <laughs> I've been reading so much. My like my mouth and my freaking voice is tired. Ah! Made me remember it again. <laughs> no, stop! Don't look. Uh -oh. Why is this a truth bullet? Why is this embarrassing pose a truth bullet? Under this very table, Byakia was. F first, I should investigate the top of the table. But the only thing on top of the table that catches my eye is this desk lamp. Looks like an antique lamp, it looks rather heavy. The power cord was connected to the outlet, so it could have been. Would have been useless during the blackout. Other than that, there's nothing else on the table that really stands out to me. So, that's the time to flinch. I gotta do it. I let her shout. Curse myself. Dude, don't give me hints. Immediately, I noticed an unexplainable smell, like crusted iron hanging in the air. It's smell blood. What is that tape, though? I've been doing the stinging pain in the back of my eyes. I slowly shifted my gaze towards Byakuya's body. Oh, the tape is where the fucking knife was. He hid the knife beforehand. Byakuya was planning on murdering somebody, wasn't he? But he was killed before he could carry that out. Byakuya Togami, the ultimate affluent progeny, is the kind of guy who said a lot of hurtful things. Tried his best to lead everyone. Why do you have to end up like this? The only thing I can do right now for Byakuya is to uncover the truth behind his death. Bloody knife, is this weapon that killed him? Hold on, how'd the killer bring this knife to the dining hall in this first place? Byakuya thoroughly patted down everyone and thoroughly inspected every corner of this old building. Now all the confiscated dangerous items are supposed to be placed in that Duralin case. It's possible they stole this knife from the case. Impossible, because Peko Pekomaro has it. Or they hid it somewhere hard to find. Paint. Yeah, I don't know what that is. In the dim light beneath the table, it seems to. Oh, it's going to the dark paint. So it could be found in the dark. Something stuck in the back of the table. Duct tape? What is this? Looks like binoculars. Uh, it's the it's the freaking pair of night vision goggles. It's, it's, what, <clears throat> it's what belongs in the case. Oh, I'm hey. tired of talking. Oh my god. Those aren't binoculars. What are perhaps they? night vision? They don't even look like binoculars.
Did the killer use the night vision goggles to kill Byakuya during the blackout? Face down under the table, collapse, just shooting you know, through something. This is he was. According to the Monokuma file, he was repeatedly stabbed between the throat and abdominal region. Repeatedly stabbed. Would one of us really do something so horrible? I mean. Yeah, look. It literally it's it's stabbed in a line. So he would have had to have been stabbed from underneath the floorboards. And they get, he got stabbed in the throat first, I'm guessing, cuz he didn't scream or anything. Blood flowing beyond his body formed a huge pool under the table. That's a lot of blood. There's blood splattered everywhere. Even the inner side of the tablecloth is covered in blood. The blood might have splattered all over the place when he got stabbed. There don't seem to be any drag marks leading from the blood pool. Because that's where he died. He wasn't moved at all. Air conditioning, huh? Why can't you act a little more grown up? Oh. The timer is set to 11.30 p.m. Oh. Mechanical the mechanical sound that came before the back out came from his air conditioner. My flashes of inspiration aren't as bad as I thought. I'm guessing the beep is some sort of signal for the murder. Hajime. Hey. We'll finish with the investigation here. Would you like to hear what everyone else has to say together? If I go by myself, some people not might want to talk to me out of caution. We've been told that one of us is a killer. It could be helped if everyone's on edge right now. <laughs> You're easy to talk to. I feel like you have a scent similar to mine. <laughs> Thanks. Nagito. Now then. He's just Makoto. The blackout that took place at the time. We have you're right. I see, I see. Investigation be done on foot. Yes. So I must use my feet. I'm going around for the part this reason. Hey. Hajime, I just realized something. Could she by any chance know what happened during the blackout? Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. Are you serious? Oh, <laughs> I thought it was a Kane, not a Yuji. Hey. <laughs> Lali la la. 
I'll hardly eat it for breakfast. I see. I mean, I'm like, it'll be easy as pie, except eating fried rice with gravy for breakfast is kind of heavy. <laughs> Any fried rice that isn't fried rice with gravy is so wrong. <laughs> Leave it to me, I'm gonna take a bite yep. out of you. Aww. The first person to raise a voice in blackout was <gasps> Mahi. It's a blackout! Kazuichi. Hey! I can't see anything! It's pitch black! My future is pitch black! <laughs> No more voices, one after the other. Everyone, calm down! Ah, don't step on my feet! Kiyohiko. That might be useful. What the hell? What's going on here? Byakuya. Th this is. Ow! Turn the damn lights on! I can't eat like this, you know! You guys? Where are you? W wasn't the blackout just in the kitchen? Perhaps the breaker overloaded? Oh, I get it. Hold on a sec. I'll go along the wall and do something about it. <laughs> Was Teru Teru in the room? During the blackout? <laughs> or before the blackout? I don't even remember. I was thinking about what Byakuya said during the blackout. What Byakuya said? Hey. Why did he say something like that? Remember, why was he able to say that? What the hell is going on here? This is... What do you mean? Hmm. About that, well, I'm just going to see it a little bit more. For now, I can't really say anything for certain. Well, it's not like I really care. Yep. And wait, don't you think Ibuki's account just now is an important clue that will lead us to the truth? Yahoo! Praise me and let me bite you. Ibuki's account. Um. It is strange, no? It appears that the wall is a different color and material. Why is that? Perhaps. Oh, it's probably a fire door. It's a door that shuts to keep fire from spreading by containing it. If that happens, you can run away, right? Wow! <laughs> I am ashamed! Fire door, huh? Didn't even notice this. Can I go through it? Why is not why is Nagito here? Nagito is my Kyoko? Guess that's about it. <laughs> mm -hmm. No, he wouldn't have killed the cow. Party dishes. Not sure how that would be relevant. Ah. Uh, <laughs> I 
first I thought I was just in the kitchen, but then when I found this, you get out of the kitchen. The hallway was pushed back too, and then I heard everyone's voice, so I found along the wall, trying to find my way to the dining hall. That place was pitch black too. It was like pitch black everywhere. Can you use that kitchen stove as a light? No, 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 no. It's impossible. This gas stove needs electricity to work, so it's directly affected by the blackout. And Nagito is freaking ninjutsu. Terror Terror's account. Hmm. Looks like the knife next to Bianchi's body didn't come from the kitchen. It appears to have come from outside. How did the killer get past Bianchi's body check? That's weird. Strange, isn't it? I mean, he didn't even go easy on the girls when he was performing the patents. Okay, so the knife was Bianchi's. But I don't think he was killed with the knife that he was holding. I think he was killed with the, the, um, the spike. The iron, whatever it's called. Hey. Because there's one, one of them's missing. You're right. So, yeah. Hmm. How can Bianca was able to say something like that in the darkness? What the hell is going on here? This is, makes me wonder. The storage room is really dusty and dark. Wow. Are these irons? Looks like they were recently turned on, but why are there three irons on this ironing board? Hmm. I was like, we'll okay after the blackout, I still found these irons, but when I found them, all three of them were turned on. Turned on? Yep. It'd be bad if another blackout happened. Oh, maybe these were what caused the blackout to happen. Stain. Okay, this is new. This is unexpected. Huh? But is wow. it? Is it related though? Because the murder just happened. <laughs> yep. Hajime. Nagito. Now his name sounds like Naruto. They both start with N, end with O. <sighs> hey. 
Hey! Hmm. Yeah. Hajime. The old building circuit breaker could be inside this office. If you're related to the blackout, it's better if you check on the circuit breaker first. Where is it? Oh, there's a monokuma down there. Uh, I've been found! Maybe wasn't isn't Pekka the killer? Nagito. What do you think? I that? mean she went out somewhere and even though she was supposed to be in the office, I'm gonna look for Bianca after the blackout with the left story, but when I got there she was gone. Well I just didn't say this too loudly or else Miss Sonya will yell at me. Hmm. Pekka's probably the one who tripped the circuit breaker and used the blackout to her advantage to kill Bianca. It's solid. Hey. It's not like you look any better. Yeah. Kazuichi's account. Oh, why is it up there? See. Hmm. That's why it's so mysterious. Someone must have reset the breaker after the blackout, but who? It's probably Peko. Whoa! Oh. Actually. You idiots had no idea what to do about the blackout, so I'm the one who reset by the circuit the breaker. Way, oh, by the way, I'm not the one who tripped the breaker. The killer did that, of course. But how did someone as small as you reset the breaker? Hey, um... Firstly, my eyes work real good at night, and I have no trouble seeing in the dark. If you want to know how to reset the circuit breaker, <laughs> my body stretches. You know, I'm very elastic. I won't be fooled. It's true. It was the irons. <laughs> you doubt me, correct? <sighs> Pekka's a good girl. An unexpected blackout occurred, and during that time, Biathia was anyway. killed. Sir Breaker in this office. Naturally, it looks suspicious since I was supposed to be here. Wait! Supposed to be here? Does I that see. mean so I was right? You weren't in the office. But why? She's supposed to grab the circuit breaker in the Duralamine case with the weapons in it? <gasps> so where'd you run off to on your own? Well Well that is <sighs> Ugh. Yeah. <sighs> She's dying? What the heck? Hey. Oh, the food. Food poisoning. <laughs> huh? That's right. That means we have to check on Akane too.
Did Nekomaru eat food? I won't be fooled. Sounds like no, that's wrong. No, that's wrong! There is no... No, no it's wrong! Shoot! I'll stretch real quick. Actually, I'm gonna go pee too, so. Good to get up and shit. Even though I'm almost done. When I when I finish the investigation, the stream's over. And I'll do the I'll do the uh, class trial next time. But my first class trial. Timer has been set to 11:30 p.m. Wasn't the timer for the air conditioner in the dining hall also set for that time? <gasps> They're connected then. Duralum and Kriggs should contain all the dangerous items Jackie collected. Hey. Yep. Now, now. It's forbidden to tamper with the crime scene. But if we don't, we can't check inside this case, right? <laughs> so I should open it. This guy, he doesn't feel any remorse. See? For the those skewers don't fit. <laughs> it's not possible that the killer took anything from here, because the key to this case was inside the case back I had with them. I guess you're right about that. Now then. I like Nagito. Nagito's cool. Yep. Hey. Back yep. his cottage? Hey. <laughs> it 
It's like instead of living in doubt with doubt in others, it's so much better to die believing in others. I see. As I thought, you are strong and you are definitely the chosen one. Chosen by Hope Peak Academy. All right. All right. Strange scene. Uh-oh. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? What am I doing, you say? Ha! Now that is truly a foolish question. Um, we're just checking to see if we can get under the floor from here. Under the floor? Why? Who said it was futile? Who decided it was impossible? How did you know I cannot recover my earring? If it is possible to get under the floor, it'll change our understanding of the murder, I think. So I thought it was important to check it. Yeah, Chiaki. I see. See? Hey. The cupboard lady didn't reach the table where we found Byakuya's body, right? Hmm. The garden hall floor had huge grass between the floorboards. And it's possible. <laughs> yeah, dude. That's what I thought. Yep. That's what I thought. I'm trying to see if we can get under it from here. Well. Mm -hmm. But. A wow. hidden hole. If you could get under the floor from the outside, there'll only be one logical suspect. The only person who didn't come to the party and also doesn't have an alibi. Ooh, Hiko. So... I suspected him too. That's why I'm checking to see if it's possible to get under the floor from outside. Well? Speaking of which, not long after I began guarding the entrance, Ooh, Hiko came here. Being here all in a place like this. Yep. I'm standing guard so Monokuma doesn't come inside. Huh. How diligent of you. Hey, hey. You're not coming to the party? What are you saying? Hell no, not even you paid me. Parties are stupid, they make me want to peek. You want to come to the party, right? Is it that way you came here? You. Of course not, I was just going for a damn walk. What, do I have to report to you every time I want to go for a fucking walk? That's wrong. No, it's not like that, but... <laughs> leave me alone. Hmm. Hey, Chiaki! Hmm. She kind of reminds me of Chihiro. Then he just left. Hey, hey. He's like the main character of an RPG. Have you played this before? I see. I'm glad. You keep saying you're glad, but we have no idea who the killer is. I guess for now we should stick to the plan and head over to Bianca's cottage. <laughs> Whoever ate the food got food poisoning. That's probably why Biakia said this is. I have not unleashed even half of my power yet. So... Um... 
Yep. Guess I should get Fuyuhiko's account. I'm the killer I think whatever you want I'm being used to being I'm used to being mistrusted you know, just tell me what you're doing while everyone else is at the party huh checking my alibi huh hm. well I don't have one I was just chilling in my cottage all by myself during that time the whole time because Jackie said she saw you in front of the old building shut up jeez don't fuck with me <laughs> He's a little <laughs> softy. The little tennis ball head. <laughs> His head looks like a tennis ball. <laughs> All right. Well, I was neighbors with Biakia, so. Hey. Hey! Did you call me? Hey. What's this? <laughs> <laughs> A letter sent to Byakuya? That's weird. There's no sender. It looks pretty suspicious. Hajime. Check what's inside. You're right. Let's see. Be careful. The first kill will happen tonight. Someone will definitely kill someone. Who sent this? This is... You're trying to create a scenario in which everyone can monitor each other. You thought if you did that, nobody would be able to kill anyone. So you believe, you believe this crazy letter? What? Couldn't ignore the possibility of this happening. You knew it was just a worst case scenario. Hey. Remember what Byaki kept saying? How he wouldn't let anyone become a victim? He wouldn't overlook that slim possibility to just keep his own promise. Why did he keep it a secret if he had just told us? Nope. He probably couldn't. He probably thought that was also a worst case scenario. What do you mean? Mm. If everyone knew what was in this letter, whether it's a lie or not, everyone would likely begin to doubt each other, and at a point, there'd be no turning back. So Byaki had tried to do something about all this by himself without telling anyone? Yep. The strong sense of responsibility is the only explanation I can think of. Anyway, whoever sent Byaki this letter has also killed him. So what are you saying? Sorry. Uh, I know this could be a prank and might have nothing at all to do with Byaki's death. Came all the way here, so I can think of the only person who wrote this letter murdered Byakia. If that's the case, that person completely predicted how Byakia would react once he received it, right? 
They plan to manipulate Byakuya and kill them right before our eyes in the old building. Who the hell would do that? Hey. <laughs> you asked my hero for a favor earlier, right? Sorry. Hey. Mikan. Which was Mikan again? It's her, right? No. Mikan. Yeah, the autopsy girl. No Kimmy. Overprotective parent, but the parent parent has the reason to be overprotective. Huh? Bye now. Monokuma. No. Why are they all wearing shells? So it makes sense nice of going inside since it's dangerous because of the renovation. Weird. <laughs> okay, so we have to find the hole where they got underneath the floor. Is that Nekomaru? Or Soda? Huh? <laughs> Nekomaru need die, I've been reborn, I have no intention of losing anymore. <laughs> Who was in there? Sheesh. But I'm pretty sure he was shaken up by the whole ordeal. Oh well, best not to go into it. Wait, so you're saying the bathroom door is shut from the or the party? So what I mean is Thank <laughs> you. 
What are you doing in here? You tell me using two photos to took before. I tried to pinpoint where everyone was standing. When I did, the diagram was the result. Everyone's standing position. Before the blackout, everyone pretty much the dining hall. So Teru Teru's place is unknown. Chiaki and Peko. I like her name's cute. She has she does have a cute name. Peko Peko Maru. I've made this diagram from analyzing these photos, I'm pretty sure it's accurate. What's this line extending from the table where Byaki was killed? That's the extension cord to the lamp. Um. Take the clues hidden here. Extremely important clue. Um. Did you find anything? I'm much sure within reason to perform an autopsy on Byakuya's body, and I discovered that there were several puncture wounds around Byakuya's chest and abdominal region. Deep wounds, deep enough to reach his lungs and internal organs. So it was with the spike. It can be assumed that a very thin, sharp object around 5 millimeters in diameter was used to stab him over and over again, which is what I believe. Yeah, it was the missing spike. It was Teru Teru. The murder weapons what tells me who does it. But how did he do it? Oh no. Alrighty guys, it's finally time. That's right, it's time for the long awaited class trial. Now then, I shall tell you all the meeting place. At the central island of Jabberwock Island, there is a mountain with my adorable face carved into it. Really? That, this right? my is? friends, is Monokuma Rock. Once you're there, please proceed to the underground by taking the elevator located at the secret entrance. <laughs> I'll see you soon. Okay, that's the end of this stream. Da 
Matt, you just got back right when I, uh, am ending the stream. Stream is about to end. Yeah, dude. I'm play I've been streaming for seven and seven and a half hours. And I played mostly this game for six and a half hours. I streamed Apex for an hour. And then I played this game for six and a half hours. And I'm only just at the first trial. Alright. Thank you for coming. Um, I'll probably do... Actually, I don't even know if I can do it tomorrow. Tomorrow's Christmas. Father Christmas. Um. Maybe tomorrow? Most definitely on the 26th, though. Okay, thanks. Thanks. Hang on. Is there someone I can raid? Let's check. Nah. Okay. Thanks for coming.